Hello, everybody. This is probably really strange. Can you give me an H if you can hear me? Oh my God, that's on. They can hear me. How about that? That's cool. Um, look at everybody in here. Oh, there's there's Aaron. Aaron's here. Okay. This is really strange because I know you're like, why are you here? This is definitely not why I come to this channel. It's because Light's over there on a phone call doing some really cool shit. But the biggest thing about her, she's always super punctual. So she said, you're going to go start that stream. And I came over here and I was like, I'm just going to start clicking buttons until it, it turns on. And I think we got it in right at 8. I just said that phrasing. Here we go. All right. So I'm just going to buy her a little bit of time um, and go from there. So let's do what she does and let's go through the chat over here. Hello, Unbroken. How are you? Hope all is well. It's been a long time. I know you're probably jonesing for the next Bloodborne, but that's not going to be up until Sunday. Um, Javier, what's up, guy? How are you? Kobo, what's good? Good evening. I don't know how to say that name. A Cloud City. It's hello. Wow, there's lots going on here. Amari, hello. Semperfy, hello. Everybody, hello. Loner, Jay McGee, Joe, everybody, cool. All right, so to catch you up to speed, we were just at PAX East, which was super, super cool. She did a lot of cool things. We played Rugrats. That was a lot of fun. Um, hello, world according to Steve. Sup, sup, sup. Got a bunch of sups. Go for it. Where's Tegan? Jaron, Tegan's on the phone talking to super cool people. She's finishing up. She will be here shortly. A new Bloodborne. Is there a part two? No, there's... There is not. Captain Dingus with his buddy Deputy Dingus. Kobo with a super chat. Happy 14 months. Wow, nice. Wish I could have seen you guys at PAX. I was right behind you on an escalator last Friday. Tried to say hi, but it wasn't answered. I apologize if I ended up bothering you guys. Can honestly say I have no recollection of that, so sorry about that. Um, but I hope you had a good time. I really do. We got to see a lot of cool people, meet a lot of cool people. Um, so that was a lot of fun. Lemons is probably dying right now because she's like, look at this loser. Subject Delta, we actually, so we had an appointment to play the Killer Clowns demo, but they canceled on us because they double booked. We didn't have enough time to, like, go back there and play it again, and the line was always super long. So we didn't get a chance to play it, but it looked like a lot of fun. We heard from a lot of people that had a lot of fun with it. I got to say, the best thing about <clears throat> PAX for us was being able to play all the board games that were there because holy shit I thought that we had a lot of board games here but it was just walls and walls of board games and then behind all those walls it was people just tables and tables and tables of people playing board games and I was like this this is where I belong like this is me and we actually found some some cool super cool games that we might I think she said, so she did a, a video showing all the stuff that she bought, which was like thousands of dollars worth of stuff because she, she has a spending problem, but she might show it to you tonight because that's how she is. She likes to show things to people on stream, so it's pretty cool. Um, nice. All right, let's see. So, Sorry for that little tangent then. So you said to Tegan, this is my stream now. For, for, for right, oh, here she is. She's here to save the day. It's getting really hot over here. I was running out of things to say. There she is. I'm going to move over. <clears throat> they Hi. Can all, they can all hear me really well. Nice. I heard you say I have a spending problem. You do. <clears throat> no lies detected. Why is this? <laughs> you were too high. <laughs> the desk, not him himself. Although that is legal now here. Oh my god. Hi everybody. It's a tough job. 
Happy, I almost said happy Monday. What is today? Wednesday. Happy Wednesday. Tough job. Tough job. It's fun though, isn't it? Did you like it? Kristen said that she was having the best time. <laughs> Do you guys want to miss your light stream? I can go away. I'll go, I'll go play um, some Stardew. <laughs> I'm good with that. Hello, hello. Hey, I kept 62 people here. They didn't instantly click off. I'll take that as a win. That is a win. I'm going to go start my own channel now. See you guys. All right. We'll botch. We'll support. How's it going? So I got to say one more thing. Baby Lemons decided she was ready to be... <laughs> Yeah, okay, so since you said that, I wasn't sure if you wanted to talk about it yet, but can everybody give a round of applause to Lemons and Urine because they have the newest Lemons in the family. Hell yeah. <laughs> we are so excited to meet them. So everybody say congratulations to them if you wouldn't mind because <laughs> I'm going to get emotional. They just have a beautiful family. I'm so happy for them. We love you. <laughs> wow, tears already. <laughs> tears already. Tears of joy. Tears of happiness. When your friends have awesome things happen to you, it's just, it's hard not to get emotional. To them. Yeah. <laughs> Hello, Gil Fury. So yeah, we have the newest, uh, the newest lightweight subscriber. <laughs> the newest mod. Made an early jailbreak. Mm -hmm. I didn't want to say it until you talked about it because I wasn't sure if you wanted to talk about they it or not. Were, they were actually plotting to come to PAX and then mm -hmm. we got a text like the night before. They were like, so she's, <laughs> she's, on, she's on the way. And we were like, that's so dope. PAX baby. Just not really. <laughs> it's funny though because when I had first asked if they wanted to come to PAX with us, um, Lemons was like, eh, that's kind of close to the, uh, that's kind of close to the due date, due date, so I probably shouldn't, because I don't want to give birth on the PAX floor, and I was like, eh, that won't happen. <laughs> Literally the day before we were going to leave. Yeah. So it would have happened. It would have happened. Um, okay. Let's start off with our little... I didn't greet nearly everybody. It gets really chaotic really fast. It's not as it's... easy as it looks. No, it's a lot easier in the backseat. Just like it is for any backseat, I suppose. I feel like the camera is like yeah, high. Yeah, I moved it a little bit. I moved it a little bit so my whole head was in it when I was in the big boy chair. I look little. No, you look proportionate. I, I don't. You look good. I like it. If anything that I learned about PAX is that A, the people I look up to are actually cool in real life, and that was fucking dope. Wait, you, t you stole my thunder, man. I was going to say that, but then well, I just started to talk about dumb shit. I said it first. So that was thing number one that was really cool. When you, Damn. when there are people you look up to and they're actually genuinely good people, it's like the most refreshing thing because you never hear, <clears throat> you never hear stories like that. You always hear the opposite. Like you meet them and you're so disappointed. That was not the case with Pax. And when I tell you, so I've been watching Kind of Funny <gasps> for, okay. Can you shut the fuck up over there, please? I'm trying to talk. I have a sentimental moment. Okay, we're good. <laughs> He's like, take me on a walk. I will in 10 minutes. When you, like, I've been watching Kind of Funny for as long as she's been watching Kind of Funny, if not longer. But, so we both look up to that team a lot. And, like, like she said, to meet them and they're, like, cooler. They're even, somehow, even cooler in real life than they are just, like, what you see on the podcast and on the games daily and all that stuff and it's like like any room that snowbike mike in particular like any room he walked into was like instantly the vibe just was like poof, and it was like that's just like that's how i want to be that's like how everybody wants to be and he's doing it and um blessing was super super cool i was we left and i was like i don't mean to be parasocial but i could be friends with him i think i, I really <laughs> like him so much and it was like but it was a super fun time super fun time Cannon boy, thank you for becoming a member again. I was gonna put Cannon if that's okay. Vibes master, yes. Snowbike Mike is the vibes master. I he was really calling is. him like my hype man because he, literally he's the ultimate. Hype <laughs> literally, man. Um, I only got the chance to hang out with him the first night because then after that, I didn't see him again because <clears throat> we were both crazy freaking busy. Well, I went to his panel, but like 
he didn't see me because, you know, I'm like a little one in, in a mass audience. Um, but that first night, literally anybody that came up to say hi to him, he took the time to introduce me and like made my ego just like because he was just like talking me up and hyping me up. And he was more confident about my content than I was. And I was like, holy shit, maybe I do belong in this space. Holy yeah. shit, I'm not an, an intruder. What's the what am I looking for? Imposter syndrome. Imposter syndrome. Thank yeah. you. No. Kobo, thank you for renewing super, your membership. Super great. So that was really freaking cool. The other thing... Um, Damn, chat is popping. Bam! Good for you guys. Thank you, Rob. Hey! Um, the other thing, though, was like all of the developers that we met and the people that actually work for the gaming companies. So fucking cool. Yeah. Super nice. Um, I didn't meet one jerk. No. Or no... Not a single person, like, that I met from the industry was rude in any capacity. Yeah. They were all so incredibly welcoming, so incredibly kind. Um, and then the other other thing, thing number three, was, you know how they always say, keep doing what you're doing, you never know who's watching? Like, you just got to keep going, keep motivated, because you never know who's watching? I had a couple of those instances where people were like, yo, we saw your work and we really like your shit. And I'm mm -hmm. like, you, 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 what, really you, cool. you see... So that was another moment, like, holy fuck. Yeah, we took, also, <laughs> last thing, we took a picture, what, you, it's all about you, right? But we took a picture with Blessing and Snowbike Mike, and Blessing ended up putting it on his Twitter feed, and I went, I was like, four days ago, if you said that, I know it was for you, let's make no bones about it, right? But like, if my face was gonna be on something he posted, <laughs> I'd be like, shut the fuck up. No, that's, the new face of video games, no way. But here we are. We were trying so hard not to like fangirl the. I wasn't. The I told day. them. I told them straight out. I was like, I'm geeking out right now. Is this real life? Mm-hmm. Um, All right. Well, you can get started. I think I should probably take him for a walk. He's Jonesing. All right. Have fun, boys. All right. I'm gonna take my phone. Can you just while you're over? Can you just like a little bit? I think you look. You don't realize how good it looks like this. Okay. Fine. I feel short. I feel like a shorty. Wait, maybe I can just lift my chair up. Ooh, that's Ooh. another thing. Or have it go down. For anybody that cares. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> At the ripe age of 31, I grew an entire inch. So what that means, puberty, it might hit. I might grow a beard <laughs> one day. I just might grow a beard one day if I'm still growing at 31. Which means with my Air Maxes on, I'm a full 6'3" pretty great. That's why I can wear heels. It's pretty great. <laughs> My men's. Thanks. Love you. <laughs> you're on your 5'7". Are you actually 5'7"? Am I taller than you? I never noticed that. You just have such a large personality. I never noticed that. Hmm. <laughs> I don't know where to put you. All right, thank you all. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Thank you all so much. My atrocious handwriting. Please ignore it. Oh, Dan is. Oh, <laughs> yeah. All right. So, hello to everybody. Sorry, I haven't said hi to the people just joining. Whew. <laughs> <laughs> Tinder 511. <laughs> Nine foot six. Gwee, I'm sorry. Hi, Steel Tiger. Um, so we'll get started soon. I actually have nine trophies. I forgot to update the thing because, you know, I was out of the loop for a little while. Um, we miss you guys, too. We're glad to be back. I was... Uh, definitely bummed that I couldn't stream on Monday, but it's probably good I didn't because I was very tired. Um, and I needed to record Mass Effect for today. Did that go up today? <laughs> that went up today, right? <laughs> I think. But definitely glad to be back. My chair won't stop turning. Look. Why? Why do you do this? It just wants me to sit sideways. 
Oh, sorry, Skynet. We were in Boston for PAX. Yesterday? Oh, yesterday. <laughs> Thanks, Reese. Also, hello. Jordo, my favorite game is Skyrim. It's the ghost. Oh my god. Why are you why do you do this to me? Why do you do this? Um <laughs> Hold on. Per usual we're having issues. It wouldn't be a lightweight stream without them, would it? What am I even trying to do? Display capture. Whoa! That's not what we wanted. Guys, I don't do this. I, I, missed, I missed three streams and I forget what the frick I'm doing. Um, please don't do that. Please, why are you, why are you, why? 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 The cam link is, says this, that, why, just, OBS, why do you do the things that you do? I just, please, please. It's just like, literally the word, I recorded, I freaking recorded on a Monday and had no issues. No issues. All right, hold on, hold on, hold on. We're gonna try this. I had my capture card open. I think that's why. Fucked it up. Rookie mistake. All right, we're back. We're back. <laughs> we did it. The game is like, yeah, no, I'm in vacation mode. Okay, now let me know if the audio is okay though, because I had to just re-add the freaking. First try! <laughs> Is the audio okay now, though, since I just had to add it back in? Game audio is loud. Okay, thanks, Reese. Alright, so I'm, like, way behind on chat. I'm not even gonna try to catch up. <laughs> Um, I have overall figured out my camera issues, for the most part. Like, my camera doesn't freeze anymore. <laughs> it just decides, OBS just decides it doesn't want to run the program sometimes. Tio, thank you very much. Appreciate that. GTA 5 Platinum, heck yeah. Rob, hey, I'm so happy to hear that. Like what we've said, it's like not everybody's cup of tea at the beginning. Sometimes it takes a while to get into it. So I'm really glad that you're enjoying it. I always hate when I rec recommend a game and people are like, eh, actually, I don't like it. All right, we still need to pick a shit ton of flowers, man. I'm not going to do that on stream. Although I wouldn't mind if Mr. Light just ran around and did that so I could talk to you guys. <laughs> We have to do the Van Horn to Blackwater one in under 17 minutes. That's going to fucking kill me. What's this one? Mm. We still have lots of fishes. I was going to look up a list of all the fishes. I was making a list of ones that I caught, right? Yep. Here it is. I have too much shit on my desk. I need to clean my space up. 
This is redonkulous. I've been playing Skyrim again. I have my little Stones of Berenzia list. Is it Berenzia or a Berenzia? I don't, never remember. And then I have on a different notebook, my fish list. <laughs> Too many notebooks. So I need to hold myself more accountable for my freaking goals. In January, I made my bingo board with my goals for the year. And then that month I made a monthly goal tracker. And I was super on top of it. And because of it, I completed so many fucking goals. February, I made the monthly goal tracker, but I never looked at it. So therefore, I did not reach any goals. March, I didn't even make a goal tracker and I did nothing. I still managed to get some goals though because of packs, but I need to get better back on on top of it. So I need to hold myself accountable. So you guys, every week, need to be like, have you checked your goal tracker? <laughs> Maybe the first Monday of the month we'll sit down or whatever stream, the first stream of the month, we'll make our freaking bingo boards together. Leviosa. Oh, how silly of me, Reese. Skynet, that's cool. I didn't know that. I always kill my flowers. I'm the worst. When goals are your goals. Listen, my goal is to make goals. <laughs> it's the Capricorn in me. I can't help it. So what should we do? Should we do some fishing? Should we do... I don't know if I want to do a mission yet. I feel like I need to get ease back into it. Get them goals. I'll make my bingo board on the first stream of the month. And then uh, every week after that, you'll be like, okay, check your goals. <laughs> Lemons, now that you've got some time, well, you have like more time, but less time. We need to go to that one, um, that one store and my old stomping grounds that you sent me. All right, I need to look up a fish list. Gil Fury, I think I'm going to start off with some fishing. I want to finish this challenge. Maybe we'll just keep the stream going until I get all the fishes. I stream Red Dead until every fish that I need to catch is caught. That will be the entire stream. <laughs> Yuren, that's okay. You just have to play games with me. That's your job. Because you're going to have so much free time. <laughs> Listen, if you don't have the world according to Steve, if you want goals, you don't have to have goals. You don't have to. This is not a goal bully session. But if you want goals, when I'm doing my goal check-in, you can write down some goals for yourself too. What am I looking up for? Uh, RDR2. Oops, it'd help if I freaking type that in right. Fish. Compendium. Coach Lightweight. Reporting for duty. Am I still excited for WrestleMania next weekend? Uh, I haven't honestly had time to think about it. <laughs> Mr. Light and I had this whole plan to do wrestling content in the lead up and we've done none of that. We've just been too busy. Gil Fury, why don't you open it up and fish along with us? Kobo, there's no question there. <laughs> You said you wanted to ask something, but there's no question there, so I'm not sure what you're asking. Just say you're going to talk about making goals, then talk about it, and you're done. And the cap corn as well. <laughs> Semper Fi, I like that logic. That's like when I make a list with things I've already done on it, just so I can cross them off. Spatula, don't ask. We don't want it. Don't speak it into existence. But usually it's 9 o'clock. Hello, Offmain. How are you? Nice, Gil Fury. Let us know when you catch something new on your list. Yeah, Cannibal, I totally didn't even realize it was next weekend. I have no sense. My time is just so freaking skewed. So skewed. Okay. So we need a rock bass and bluegill. We got that. Redfin pickerel. I need to make a freaking spreadsheet so I can 
uh, alphabetize these. I have not caught a red fin pickerel. I have caught a perch. See, this doesn't help me because it says location. Automatically obtained during the story. Yeah, that's great, but I didn't have the challenge unlocked yet, so not helpful. Bullhead catfish. I got that. And a chain pickerel. Got that. Steelhead trout. Got that. Smallmouth. Got that. Largemouth. Don't got that. That's Lagra bait shop. Or in crayfish holes. Okay. We'll start there. <laughs> A red fin pickle. <laughs> Alex, he was taking the Ralfredo for a walk. That'd be our dog, for those who don't know. All right. Horse! Come hither. Oh, you're just taking your sweet time. You're all right, girl. Um. Camel Freak, thank you. Um. Kobo. No. <laughs> I'm sorry, but if we do go to the New York City one, that'll be a no. I'll be there with my family and for just privacy and safety, I'm going to say no to that. Baby light. When you walk. I'm going to put camo if that's okay. What are you working on? Mm. I was looking up which fish I needed to catch and where to go. So we were going to start with the... Well, Camo Freak said red fed pickerel in West Elizabeth. Because we haven't caught that yet. So we're going to start there. Because I'm just going in order of this list. So where would be the best location to go? Um, Camo Freak, where would the um, best fast travel location be? Do you have any idea? Oh, it's locked right now? Well, she is. All right, we'll hold off on that one. Oh my God, runaway marker. Strawberry? Thank you. Why is it locked for me? <laughs> Why can't I go there? West Elizabeth? West Elizabeth is a state. You can't just fast travel to Yeah, the but state. they said strawberry. Strawberry's not showing up. Um, am I in strawberry? Where am I? Yeah. Travel to strawberry because I'm in strawberry. <laughs> Guys, it's been a it's been a minute. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna sleep till the morning. Someone said real talk. I'm binging suits on Peacock and keep getting ads for WrestleMania. Dude. Oh. Dude. It's gonna be so fucking good. We're streaming both nights the entire time. I already I already responded to people in the comments saying we would do it, so we're we're locked in now. You're a woman of so what the, what are the dates the dates are saturday and sunday not this week next week yeah. which are what days why do you have plans maybe no you don't no you don't six and seven no okay. i don't you, you ain't busy i know you're not no <laughs> <laughs> so <clears throat> obviously WrestleMania won't be up on the screen, but if you want to watch along with us, we'd be happy to have you. <laughs> Crimson Cracker House, like, why can't I fast travel? What? How, how did I? Okay. 
Because I'm literally... There it is. There's Strawberry. <laughs> Why can't I have Shovel there? <laughs> what are you planning on doing? I'm going to fish. Yeah, it is. It's going to be six hours long. It'll be a long stream. Long stream. Mm -hmm. I don't got time for that. Yeah, it's called fun. And you're going to have it. Will the river be good? I'm sorry. What are you trying to get? I'm trying to get a red fin pickerel. Goddamn red fin pickerel. Red fin pickle. Can I go on the... Did you just Google a location? Well, I freaking had this list, but it wasn't helpful because it's like, oh, you catch it during the story. And I'm like, bitch, I didn't have the thing yet, so it didn't count. So the pickerels are usually like you can try Dakota River. Um, can I just it, go right here? Oh, look at that. Coma freak. Bingo. Camo. Right at this. Oh, Dude, camo. why do I always call you camo freak? I'm further away. I even wrote it as camo freak. Como. My bad. So we have a Kobo and a Como. Your A is now, now wonky O. <laughs> All right. Can you go to the Dakota? I, I, I got to imagine you didn't do anything while I was gone, right? I looked shit up. Oh, okay. I was productive, just not in that way. It seemed like, look, we got Spatula down here, and he's probably like, God, this woman can't do anything. <laughs> Spatula's like, why the fuck did I come here? <laughs> Listen, we were just shooting the shit, all right? Yep. We were catching up. No, that's the problem. You were shooting no shit. <laughs> Wait, also, do you guys want to hear about freaking Dune? I had a behind closed doors screening preview event. It was really fucking cool. I felt real special. I was there. I shouldn't have been. But I get cool stuff. And I can talk about it now. I think I'm going to do a video too, I think. But I technically, um, previews could have gone up today. But, you know, Baby Light was here, so I couldn't get it done. Um, but I can talk about it on stream, and then I'll just do like a more in depth video later this week. But the um, Dune Awaken. Yeah. Dune, Dune Awaken. <laughs> Making up new names now. <laughs> Guys, I'm out of it. My brain, I am motivated and I'm excited to be here, but my brain is like sizzled. Look at this. Hello, loner. If you want to play a game for. Oh. 90s nostalgia that's not ruined by weird writers from Nickelodeon. Rugrats. Did you guys see that conspiracy yeah. about how the Nickelodeon symbol actually looked like Epstein's Island? And then on frickin' SpongeBob, there's a driver's license that you see, and the address of the driver's license is Epstein's Island. Is an address on Epstein's Island? Like, what the fuck? You go talk What's your problem? You want. This actually has some really cool, like, pseudo random events. Hey there. Like, people who has a. I Can think I this you? is where the guy. Just taking well, a look. Spoilers hey for anybody. there. Hello there. We're with the Appleseed Timber Company. Head farming. We're still getting started on this side. Yeah, look it up. We should have some. It's a conspiracy fine, theory, but you know. Lumber for sale. I actually Very like. Soon if you're was this a bought into it? I'll conspiracy keep that in theory. Mind. We yep. should be further along by now, but what can like you do? I mean, on, look at these to dopes. About how that Not a brain between them. The Listen, oh, you got any supplies for sale? Huge ass ship, food, the size medicine. of a fucking skyscraper, Turn ramming into a bridge. Of course, it's gonna collapse. Spare anyone Hello. To to town. Not the way things You'd are call going. This guy Laszlo Applewood. I'd be happy to pay premium no, for it. Laszlo, Laszlo, Laszlo. Sell him some goods. His guys are hungry. All right. As far as I can remember, give them one single solitary carrot. <laughs> Wait, go are down you one. Give them one carrot. There you go. And maybe beans. Oh, peas. I got beans, greens, potatoes, tomatoes. Remember that? What's this? Cheese. It's a cheese wedge. You want some cheese? Wait, do I need this for Yeah, but if somebody brought that cheese wedge to a party, I you, would you'd be the so shit happy. Shit out of it. Can sweet corn? We don't. We don't want these peas. Get out of there. Captain Dingus says it's so icky. I watched all that so much as a kid, and now it feels so gross. I know. I said I tried to show her all that in 2011, and I said this was my jam. This is my favorite show. And even in 2011, I was like, ooh. Even then, I was like the jokes. I was like, man, that's not how I remember. Um, Should I sell anything else, or are we good? Nah, we're good. Hit hit the circle button. 
the old circle button. Jack, thank you very much. You always wanted to be in the cup. I appreciate that. Oh, yeah, appreciate it. Hell yeah. Give it, Jack. That should help keep us going. I have something super fun coming in tomorrow. You remember what it is? Guild Fury, what fish? Um, yes, I do. My backlisted or back ordered PlayStation Portal. So now I can play my PS5 on the go if I have Wi Fi connection. More importantly, you can just play it when we're in the living room. Right, so I'm not a prisoner in my own house. <laughs> Anyways, do you guys want to hear about Dune or no? Where's that? Or do you want to just wait for my actual official video? Yeah, Aaron, buckle up, buddy. Put your big boy pants on. You're going to be playing that with us. Oh, yeah, that's up to four players, I think, too, right? Or was it only uh, two at a time? It I think was, it's two at a time. We got the demo. So Rugrats is a side-scrolling platformer, but the music, the art style, directly from the show. Like, it... What's the best bait for the pick roll that we need? They told me already. Go ahead. Um, and action. Um, oh, we're going to get jumped. Easy. I thought this was. Yep. You still might get jumped. I'm saying that was deer running. So okay there. Oh, is this from the mission? No. Maybe. Yeah, this yeah, is from our this mission. Is from the mission. They didn't clean it up yet. Interesting. Wow, look at that so crazy. Corn! Oh, God damn. Corn paint. Anyways, I didn't watch Rugrats because I wasn't allowed to. But for those who have the nostalgia. It seemed like pretty, pretty um, faithful game adaptation, and it was a lot of fun. We don't have any. Fun. We don't have any chopped up hot, hot dogs, Captain Dingus. Um, so it's a salmon. You see the two salmon? Yes. Wait, oh, she just hold score. How do you even on this cheating mode here? This is not cheating. Why work harder when you can work easier? It's the cheese mode, and we have cheese bait on. Yeah, well. That's here you go. Thing. Yes. Dune! <laughs> Try to talk about Dune! The, the thing that I was most excited about. Oh, yeah. <laughs> was the freaking character creation was super in depth, but I leaned over the thing I was like, whoa, that's really cool. You know how a lot of times you can have like a background story? So you can, that give you like different perks and stuff. You can have that for Dune too, where you can choose which planet that you originally came from, which gives you certain abilities. You can choose your background, but then like the, the abilities that you start with like little perks in, the way they write that into the story oh, no, is the look. person that, like the commander or whatever, the tutor you had that trained you before the story starts. So I don't want to say how the story starts because that's spoilers, but you start in a very specific like situation ah, gotcha. and obviously you don't have your mentor in that situation anymore. But prior to those events, you're building this whole background story and your traits change depending on which planet you started yeah, on, um, who your mentor was, now. and what your abilities are going to be. So you have like a super wide play style that you can have too. And it can be super, super customized. So, like, the only other MMO I have experience with, so I'm really, like, not super knowledgeable about MMOs, but is WoW. And in WoW, when I was playing, depending on the race you played, depending on which class you could play. And oh, so basically wow, there was, like, some That's customization, some. but really it's just, like, race and class and then, like, your talent abilities. With this, yeah, very Mass effect -y. With this, it's your planet, your starting planet gives you certain perks. Um, you get to choose who your mentor was, which gives you different perks. You get to choose, like, your starting kind of, like, signature thing, which gives you other perks. So, like, if you're going to be more of a, like, a tanky running gunner or more of, what were they called when you got to use those mental abilities? Whatever. More, like, mental hmm. ability type things. And stealth mode and techie. Um, and then within that, you have the perk trees that are super, there was like, I don't know, like 10 across, like of the top parts of the perk tree. So very like Skyrim, where there's lots of different perk trees. 
And then within the perk trees, there's like a million different branches and things that you can do. It was just intense. Here it was we a lot. Go. Whoa. Yeah, kind of telepathy, but more so like telepathy with technology. So, Come on. like, when they showed the ability, the person like went like this, like tele telepathy. But then there's like white lines that led to all the different like technology things in there. So you could see crates that you could explode. Um, you could see where the people were located if they had like techie tools on them. Take the corn. No, I got too fast. I'm excited. And then the other thing that was kind of cool, so I haven't seen the movies, um, but one thing I thought was cool is they said that they built this more based on the books. So the way the planet looks in the movies versus how it's described in the books is very different. Well, not very different, but slightly different. So they took the approach of the books more so than the movie, and they took their inspiration more so from the books. Um... Okay. Which gave them a lot more freedom to do some cool things. Then there's a mechanic where if you're out in the sun, um, you can't be out in the sun too long, so you have to make sure you're, you're finding shade or that you have, like, technology or tools to help you. And then if you're in the sun too long, certain things happen to you. Yeah, yeah there's, like, many events that happen where there will be a spice explosion from the sand, and that's, like, a PvP event, so... You go and you can collect the spice so you can do it by hand or you can build tools to help you do it faster. Um, and then since that would be like a PvP thing, you kind of want to go with friends because other people will be there too. And if they kill you, they can get your spice and stuff. And spice is like the money. Spice is used to upgrade things. Spice is kind of every, like, super important, obviously. The sandwormy things were freaking cool. And they had different, like, if you got killed by one of the sandworms, it was more detrimental. Like, you lost your shit, and um, you started off with, they, like... Yeah, they want they stress that they want you to be afraid of it. So it's not just right. a natural death. Like, you're gonna, it's going to be a worse death. Mm-hmm. Um, and, and then they, the sandstorms, too, same thing. I saw a lot of people on IGN's video were commenting that there wonder. was no hand-to-hand -hand combat shown. And the PR lady, Tasha, who is super duper great, said, yeah, there's a reason for that, because we know how to do hand-to-hand -hand combat from the Conan game. Or Conan, sorry if I, I had to. Uh, well, you're all on on had not done guns, so we needed to get the guns down first. Uh, and I was like, that makes total sense. Good and she, you. she did say there's going to be, like, hand-to-hand -hand and melee, and that there will be, like, cool <laughs> fighting styles it. that go along with that, but they, they're they saving that for later because they've already got all the bugs worked out for that with their other IPs. So they're focusing, making sure the shooting feels good, which it looked good from the preview. Obviously, we didn't actually demo it. No, it looked like it probably felt pretty good. But it looked like it felt satisfying. You know how you satisfying. can watch something you can be like, yeah, that looks like it's good. And then um, Mr. Light had to come about the R since I haven't seen nothing. nothing. <laughs> I'm ignoring it's it. Nothing. I'm ignoring it. Um, but they have, like, those little, like, mosquito things that fly around and can, like, get you. One of the builds you can do, you can control those. Like, those little mosquito things. So you've caught all these already, right? Yeah. Go I was ahead. trying to get a, a red fin. Yeah, I just caught a chain pickerel. I don't need that. I'm there you are. You don't need that. So obviously I'm gonna do like a, a more like professional <laughs> video where I don't talk so fast. It was really exciting though. When it was first announced, I was like, ooh, hell yeah, that looks really cool. And then I found out it was an MMO and I was like, ooh, a survival MMO to boot. And I was like, ooh, that's not my jam. I really thought the building looked really fun. Oh. Like so the building is cool because, so you can build an entire building with just like the blueprints. So basically oh, you're just doing the outline, but you can see like kind of a transparent wall or floor so you can plan it out without actually having to build. And then when you get the materials, you can build it and your friends can also bring materials to help you build it. But the reason why that's cool is you can design an entire structure in just blueprints. Save nice it. Arch, ain't you? 
and then sell those blueprints on the market to other players. So if you're a player who doesn't like building and you okay. don't want to have to think about it, but you know that you need a base to create all these things, you can buy the blueprints using like the spice money system and then just collect the materials that you need. And your friends can come and just complete the blueprint with their materials as well. Um, and that's also okay. cool because she said there's going to be different biomes. And obviously you'll probably want to base in each biome because there will be perks and different things you can get in each of the biomes. So when you build with the blueprint structure, that just saves so that you can use that same house everywhere. Um, I played Grounded for a little bit when it was in like early access on Game Pass. And I loved that, but I hate, <laughs> I hate it when I was building the house. I kind of just like, you had to... At that point, it might be different now, but you had to like start from scratch everywhere you wanted to build your little your little base. So this sounds like a cool alternative to that. And overall, I was just impressed with how like of an easy entry point it seemed like it was gonna be to like the survival MMO genre since I haven't played that before. So to Delta, I haven't seen any of them, but that kind of works out because I can react to them on my reaction channel now. <laughs> Wacky, we're just trying to get one specific fish that was supposed to be at the stream. We're just not having luck with it. Nice, Jack. Well, I hope you have fun playing it, and I hope you enjoy it while you're watching it. Joe says go more south. South of the river or, like, to the south? Like, follow the river south is how I would read All that. Right, well, I just cast this, so I'm going to give it one cast. Um, Lyndon, how are ya? Joe says to the south. Like, roads, Le like, Lemoyne south? Or, like, south, just Dakota River south? Gil Fury, if you need a couple chain pickerel, come to this river, because we've gotten a couple. <laughs> the Dakota River and Strawberry. Oh, I got you. Um, I Bye, got Strawberry. You. Oh, Or, no, really, if you need a fucking perch. Sorry. <laughs> 14 You're ounces. mine. Perch. Power. Cannon Boy's brother, cut it out! <laughs> Is that for the redfin pickerel you're talking about? Um. Unbroken... The only thing people weren't complaining you a, about... You go get a legendary down there. Might as well go grab that. Okay. People weren't complaining about, but I was running out of um, space on my computer, so I had to stop a dialogue early, and they were worried that I wasn't going to be able to do that again, so I watched a video of it and reacted to the video, but then when I actually played the game, it was there still, so I didn't have <laughs> to do that. Um, You're all right, girl. I just said, well, this really sucks. Yeah, it was, I'm sure, I'm sure it was updated, but that was the only thing that was kind of funny. But it, they weren't complaining, they were just like, oh dang, we wish you could have seen that, but they were all very understanding of why I had to stop recording. Fast as a bullet. Um, want to see how yours compares? I'll race you to Diablo And then you always get the comments that are like, oh, you missed something, but I won't say what, and it's like, then why even say that? <laughs> Oh yes, they did complain that I was too good at the game. Rape, no, 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 you were not the only one. There were lots of people who said the same thing, and that's totally fine. I had no issues with that. I had no issues looking up the video to see it. It's just, it, you know, that was on me. I should have checked first. They would have just randomly spawned her back in for this. Hello, highly mistaken. Hello, he 
punch you. How are you both doing today? Well then, if I wasn't have, if I wouldn't have gotten the reactions, it was good that I watched it anyways. But like I said before, I don't want it. Um, tips and help. Jeez, whoa. I don't like where this joke is going. Sure. Okay, so answer the question. Sure, I'd love to hear a tip. See a tip. Really? <laughs> okay, well, the question here is. Um, what plants are these? These are our burdock root. I think we definitely already got that. I'm just picking it up because I found it. Well, we don't know. We gotta check the list. We have it. Too many lists. And away it goes. And out it goes. Look at this guy. Look at this tough guy. The horse is like. The Bray Wyatt documentary? I don't think I've heard about that. Did yeah. you hear about that? Yeah. Because I'm in the know. Well, we didn't write that down, so... Alright, well, we're not doing See, this is why we have lists. Oh, okay. Barry, thank you very much. Don't know much. Don't know how much you're into game requests, but there's these games, Prototype 1 and 2. Really like to see more people play them and you can check them out. It's you, sir, are a fish. You, Guess sir, are a fish. A steel hand trout. You already had that. No, we didn't. Yes, you did. Shut the flock up. Show <laughs> me. Show me right now. I'm going to give you a tip. No more back talk today. That was rude. What? That was rude. You're rude. Um, Barry, thank you. I will make sure Prototype is on the request list. I'm always looking for things that are... Sorry, I just keep turning it and then I'm like... I know, it's, I'm just trying to lean and you're just... You're just not it. Oh, move up higher so you don't push me around sideways, Lack. Alright. Guess what? Chicken butt. I know not everybody here follows you on Twitter. I might have to show my God of War controller. Do it! Real, real, real great. <clears throat> real good shit. Wait, this is... People are just real tough in here. That's amazing. I'm just trying to fish this. You're on the fish away. I reeled that in from... Ah, Woohoo! Come here. If that's not a red pin pickerel, I don't know what it is. I don't know. Those pins look pretty blue to me. <laughs> Alright, hold on. Look at it. We've got two notebooks with two <laughs> Boom! Keep that. My handwriting is so sloppy right now. My K's and my E's, it looked like an L double E. <laughs> Two fishes and one pound. Oh, bitch, get out the way. I do have a Twitter and I have an Instagram. Oh, right. bitch, get out the way. Please don't do. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay, bye. bye. Right. <laughs> See you next time. <laughs> Dude, you give Mr. Light the camera for five minutes and all of a sudden he wants to be a pro streamer. Power. Power. We're gonna cut here. What? Look how cute my shirt is. Hold that that up right there. Controller chaos. They had so much cool shit, it was hard to pick. But there were two two or three God of Wars. Two God of Wars, a Red Dead that they weren't selling, and a Mass Effect one. I'm not gonna lie though. Didn't love the Red Dead one. Comes in. Find it anyways. Yeah, but here we go. Check that bad boy out. Mm. Not sponsored it's, by Controller Chaos, by the way. Not at all. Super deep red, fake blood at the bottom. Gotta love it. Turn it around. It's like the Jotunheim gold on the back. It's about as cool as it gets. I might not even use it. 
I might just hang it for it to look beautiful. Yeah, you don't want to get your hand oils on it. What are people saying? They liking Ooh, it? Ooh, that's cool. Clean as fuck. Yeah, nice. Yeah, that's pretty sick. Sweet. <laughs> Commercial break? Hell yeah, bro. So, yeah. That made my trip. I was Yo, super... the blood. Yeah. Yeah, dude. That controller's very cool. Looks great. So, now back to your regu regularly scheduled programming. This one. Here we go. Uh, Mass Effect looked cool. It was an Xbox controller. It was just the, um, uh, like, it was, like, with on it. It was like this, I have a picture of it, but it, it looked like Shepard's armor, <laughs> basically. Let me see, hold on, let me find the picture. I took a picture because I want to buy it, but, you know, I spent yeah. too much money already. And these controllers were not cheap because they're hand-painted. There she loads. Cannon Boy, so Mr. Light told me his prediction for WrestleMania oh, yeah. and said, well, write see, this down. See, yeah, what day was that? Because now everybody has stolen it since. To be fair, we told Blessing and Mike before, though. So they mm -hmm. can back us up. Yeah. They can back us up. Sorry. Not to have a text thread going. I got distracted. <laughs> <clears throat> yeah, so that's Controller Chaos. Check them out. They have a website. Yep. Website wasn't super duper impressive. The, the N7 in premium box. The fuck is that? I want that. Sorry. You got no. a premium box? No. The, what, what was that about the premium box? Mass Effect premium box. Oh, nice. Nice, bro. All right. What ne What is next? You want to try to catch this fish? I want to get all these fishes. Wait, do you want to get this legendary since we're here? Sure. Where'd the website go? Maybe. Um, next was going to be a largemouth bass from Le Gras. We're going to go down just a little bit. All right. The Le Gras just... bait shop or found in crayfish holes. You're just going to you're just gonna pipe down. Over pipe down. Aren't you going to walk like a tough guy? Big stick. Walk. What is that? Teddy Speak Roosevelt? softly and carry a big stick. And carry a big stick. Feel free, that's probably really cool. I really should have put this away because this is a maximum. Amount of I have a C3PO controller from my R2D2 360. That's pretty cool. Teacher Tegan comes out. Actually, on, <laughs> on our drive to Boston, we freaking looked up the, <laughs> a list of all of the presidents. No, so and I've what been, they were known for. <laughs> I've been getting, now that I'm out of school and can't learn anything, like, usually, I'm, like, all of a sudden interested in history. So, like, I was like, oh, let's learn about all, so I started watching the documentary on Netflix about the Cold War. Well, Oppenheimer really got me into that. And then, so I'm like, yo, my boy FDR, I bet he was the best president. Everybody, all the shit, he had the New Deal, he had all this shit. Who do you think was first on the list? It was motherfucking FDR. And I was like, that's my guy. <laughs> my boy. <laughs> All right. This is going to be on you to make this so um, speak softly and cast a good rod. Is the, the bait already baited? No, you got to bait it up. So. Oh, there it is. Bingo. Yeah, it's on there. Okay. See, I don't think it's, I don't think, like, if you just ask anybody out on the street, like, Jimmy, is it Jimmy Kimmel oh, that, like, ask that. weird questions? People on the street? Well, they're not weird questions, Or easy but... questions. Oh, oh, I forgot Damn. about the whole fucking, I can't pull it in my chain. You bro. So, I, forgot I, don't, how to I don't think it's anybody fine. off the street is just saying, oh, FDR. Here we go. Like, maybe smart people. Maybe smart people are saying FDR. I think most people would say George Washington. Or they'd say, I mean, I think another passable answer Abe would Lincoln. probably be Abraham Lincoln. Yeah, he fucking did a shit ton. I what is it? Is it Aaron? He's like well, not the, not a great theater guest or something like that, but great president. I, I forget who said that, but we were all dying. I'm running out of freaking. Hey, you're ne you're gonna lose your mind. Aaron just said, "Who was the fat one that got stuck in the tub?" <laughs> 
We looked that up. She was like, "There, I know there was one that got stuck in the tub. I was like, I think it was Taft, but then it didn't say that on his little, his little thing on the website we were looking at. And I was like, shit, maybe it wasn't Taft. So then I looked up the story. And actually, the story is pretty fucking funny. So that is just a you wives' tale. Too much. That didn't actually happen. However, the reason that rumor was started was because... Um, when he was president, they had to special custom order a tub that would fit his, his, um... Don't forget to use the stick. Oh, thank you. It, you know, flick your stick. His, his, um, larger girth. And then the story really took flight because he was on vacation and he got oh, in a smaller oh, tub and filled it with too much water. Friend. So the water spilled over... And You're coming um, with me. That bad boy. spilled over and flooded the floor and drenched the guests underneath him. <laughs> His loquacious girth. So he didn't actually get stuck in a tub, but pick that burdock root. There's, you know, there were reasons why that story took hold. Took hold. Yeah, that would be unfortunate. You're welcome. That was Teacher Light. Happy to bring her back anytime you want. Well, different times. Gaps in the floor and all. Different times. Well, yeah, you think about like Minnie's haberdashery. Wait, floorboards. Mm -hmm. Like there was no subfloor. Is that water drinkable? Depends on how thirsty you are. What water? The Taft water. Oh. I have, I presume. Oh. I'm broken. Go for it. Okay, so who are you? What are you Class getting next? Class is in session. I need to go to LeGras for a large mouth bass. So would that you, be? LeGras is like the word LeGras, and then you can look up the bait that you're supposed to use. It's a Boner, gifted five lightweight gaming memberships. Good, we need all the gifts back because there's not as many members as there used to be. Kevin Hill got a membership. Take a picture. Kevin! Hold on, no. Where's Ken? Boner, thank you for donating the memberships. Appreciate you. Yeah, that was pretty easy. It was like your second try, and it would have been your first if you just... Didn't break the line. Didn't, you know, forget about it. Wasn't a loser! Is this light is going to tell us something that's going to scar me for life? Possibly, but probably not right now. What is that? Didn't Lincoln need something special because... Okay, of boy. Um, maybe? I don't know. It's possible. Hey, boy. Unbroken. Yeah, I think right now Bloodborne is going to be just once a week, but I'm going to make them buku long videos. Like, like buku long. Like we're talking two, three hours. So you don't have to watch it all in one sitting. You can kind of spread it out throughout the week. But that way it will still be the same amount of content, just on one day versus two. Wait a minute. I just read something unsettling in the chat that I have to address. Kobo? After spending all your time on Red Dead Online, you cannot abandon it, buddy. You just gotta grin and bear it. You did the hard stuff already. You gotta keep playing, guy. You gotta keep playing. Do it for her. Get that platinum. Why for me? Find your why. Do it! You gotta do it! You do can't... it for yourself, not you, for me. You can't you... be motivated because of somebody else. You gotta be motivated for the interior motivation. You can't, you can't stop. You did the online, you did the hard part. Five hour long Mass Effect videos. Skynet, I have been making them a little bit longer. They've been over an hour. Bloodborne. I'm gonna be so fucking rusty and they left off in the middle of a freaking boss fight. You know what I've been playing? Oof. You're in. That's a lame reason to be motivated. I'm just kidding. Children is an adequate. Is an adequate Jeez. motivator. Online was the easy part. I don't know, dude. You were bitching quite a bit about online for a while there. Maybe bitching is harsh, but like, like, 
complaining about how long it took to get to level 50? Man. And you did it. So. You did it. Um, Cannon Boy, what's a Slammy Award? Is that a wrestling thing? It's like the Oscars of wrestling. Oh, yeah. no, I nope. did not. Nobody really cares about them. Like, yeah. Well, do people care about Oscars? You should have seen, I think it was like last stream or two streams ago. I was out here because I was trying to get some um, challenges right done. And I couldn't, ah! I couldn't see the gators for the life of me because it was dark. And my horse would just like oh, freak okay. out. And I'm like, what is happening? And I'd be like standing basically on top of the gator. We have not run into the ghost lady in this playthrough. I think I saw her in my first playthrough. Hold L2 to grip the rod firmly. Um, what was the bait you needed? Crayfish. Spatula! Ghostly! This could work. Thank you, guys. Wow, 15 whole memberships. Let's Holy go. Holy shnikes! Everybody, hey, you're getting the videos up early for members, so there's actually reason to be a member these days. There is. That was indeed, oh, that was quite the cast. Yeah, why don't you just cast it all the way to the Dakota River? <laughs> Okay. Bet. Okay, bet, she says. <laughs> Kevin said, oh, thank God I was worried. You should have been, Kevin. You should have been. Can we tell them what they need to do to tell them about it? Sure. I told them you're down with, like, showing... Show them cool stuff because they're on the stream. Mm -hmm. Just like the only access. Yeah, I have a video that I recorded that you guys will see. Mr. Light. Oh, okay. Yeah. Bingo. Nice. First one try. Done. One shot, one kill. Okay. Here you go. Um, Just real quick. Right back to me. I think I am. I'm going to stream. What should I stream first, Skyrim? No, you can't stream Skyrim before I stream Skyrim. What? Nah, I'm gonna stream. I'm on Sunday. I'm gonna stream Skyrim for no. twelve hours straight. No. And I'm gonna say I'm gonna title it "Streaming Skyrim Until I Cure My Seasonal Depression." No. And um, I no. don't. Know, I don't. Know, I'll stream to nobody. I don't give a shit. This is no. so enjoyable. You're not allowed okay. to stream Skyrim before I do. Okay, I'll do The Witcher Three then. Okay, but also I need to record all day on Saturday and Sunday. So. So this here is one of these guys. Ooh, I pulled this. Not the one of the reversible. It's a she. Okay. Sad, mad. So we get it. We get it for baby light. And she's like, this is great. I, well, she doesn't say that, but she's two. She's like, ooh. So guess, take one guess. Anybody. What she names Unless this you thing. follow me on social media, then don't because spoilers. Reese would watch my. Witcher 3 stream? You can stream The Witcher 3. That's fine. I'm going to do it on Twitch, though. All right. Then you can teach me how to do Twitch. We'll, we'll work out all the kinks with me when nobody yeah. watches yeah. it. Yeah. No, you're going to have three viewers. No, I know. I think Risa is not on Twitch. So she decided to name this. No pushing. She says, Octopussy. And we've been trying to record it so we could just... So I actually, I'm going to get her to record it so I can chime it in on the video when you say it. I think that'd be funny. Octopussy. She's never heard that word. She's only heard octopus. She said, yep, this is octopussy. So she's been telling people, this is my octopussy. You should have heard her. I freaking took her to the grocery store and I wouldn't let her bring it into the grocery store because last time I let her bring a toy and she lost it. So I did not let her bring it in. And she goes, I want my octopussy. 
And then she was just yelling, Octopussy! And I'm like, There's a. Okay, yep. Yep, you're Octopussy. Yep. It's not here. Sorry. <sighs> Wait, we got a bunch of people on Twitch. The I'm world according to Steve, I, I think it's because we had a Bond marathon when she was in the womb, so she heard it through osmosis. Thanks, Coma Freak. I will be. I'm going to start streaming on Twitch at some point, just not yet. Yeah, I guess I'm going to work out the kinks. I'm gonna James do Bond it. fan for life. Start The Witcher from the beginning. Oh, past life. Maybe she Maybe she was the actress who played Octopussy. Who the heck knows? Wacky Valor, likely she didn't say it in the register line. She just said it when we were walking through the aisles. Also, I gave some ladies a dirty look because Baby Light <clears throat> has RBF just like I do. She is her mother's daughter through and through. She does not like people unless she knows them. And even then, it's questionable. Even, no. It just depends on the mood and who you are. She pretty much likes her grandparents and her aunts and uncles, us, and that's it. And Ken. So, you know, RBF. Ken, Ken out of nowhere was, like, possible. She has, like, <laughs> she has RBF. And I'm walking by, and these two older ladies go, oh, look at that, look at that, oh, fuck what they say. Look at that little sour smirk she's got going. Sour and I'm just like, smirk? bitch, you don't know her. She's not being sour. She's just existing. Mind your beeswax. The fuck? The fuck? Lemons, she likes you when your children are not around. Because <laughs> she hates kids her own age. So where are you going next? The we're, fuck? We're not even on the, the game. Don't talk about my child's RBF face. Only I can talk about my child's RBF. Ooh, Undertale, somebody just asked about. Okay, a muskie. Ooh, a muskie. We got that. Oh. And a lake sturgeon. You don't have that. We don't have that. So we need to go to Le Gras, the bait shop, but we need a lake lure. We have those in spades. I know. We, that's just what we have to put up. Okay. Lake lures are excellent for catching lake sturgeon and muskie. She does love little lemons, especially like when you send videos. She loves, she, she'll say she'll say his name and she'll be all excited and ask to rewatch them. But then in person, nope. <laughs> Nope. <laughs> Too much for me. Old people, they just don't know. Oh my god. And then don't even get me started on the old lady at Target. We won't. We won't. Oh, but I'm gonna. I won't ask. I'm gonna. I was at Target with Baby Light. This was a different day. Because I needed stuff to dye Easter eggs so we can dye Easter eggs for the Easter Bunny. This old lady cuts me off coming out of the aisle. And I'm like, okay, you know what? It's hard to see out those aisles. I do that too want intentionally. But, you know, she didn't apologize. And I was like, that's kind of annoying. But, okay, fine. Whatever. Then she's walking really slow down the main thoroughfare. And I'm like, okay, that's annoying. But she's old. I'm going to cut her a break. I need to take some belly breaths. It's okay. Then she freaking stops herself directly in front of me when there's a worker on one side and the worker's cart on the other. So I can't go around. So I'm stuck there. And she's just stopped. Doing nothing and going nowhere. Not looking at anything. Just stopped. Just stopped. And I was like, bitch, please move. Because now Baby Light is getting squirrely. I think, uh, hold on. I think we caused some confusion. What? Um, she will never stop streaming on YouTube. Um, so if your preferred place is YouTube, that's great. Um, I don't, your, her plan is, because I know that so many people have been wronged by YouTubers going over to Twitch and then like leaving YouTube behind. That's not her intention whatsoever. Um, I have no interest in that. No. She doesn't even she doesn't really want to solely ever be a streamer. It's just um It's fun bonus content, but it's not what I want to do solely. Right. My main content, my main focus will always be pre-recorded videos. These are just added fun bonuses. And that's all for you. Well. Come on. Anyways, so she finally starts moving. She crop dust me. And it was nasty. Nasty! Like, to the point, even Baby Light was like, ooh, stinky! Like, I'm not even kidding. She said that. We get to the aisle. No one's in the aisle, so I have my cart parked in the middle of it, and I'm looking at shit. Then she turns on the aisle, so I was like, oh, okay. I'll be nice. And I move over to the side. And I'm looking directly ahead of me, but on the other side, because I thought she was going to walk by. Nope! This freaking old-ass lady parks her cart Holy directly in front balls. of me. Look at that you thing. sure? Stops directly in front of me to look at the things I was looking at. Like, literally blocking me 100%. And I'm like, are you fucking this? 
<laughs> I needed to find Jesus. I was about to you, say something. You got a channel catfish. You weren't going for it, but that's a 19 pound fish. You would have got the trophy with that. Oh, you should have thrown it back. Oh. Can I now? Um, it's pretty good. It's really not good. Rise tarnished. <laughs> I started playing Elden Ring. I gotta say, it's been fun following you guys. I would not be having. <laughs> Messed up. She's Dirty. Okay, what was that? A channel catfish. A channel catfish. I asked. Well, I don't want to go there, but I decided to give it another chance. Found a really nice guide, and I've been liking it. Game that I used to hate. We still need a. Uh, Whatever we were here for. Large. No. What were we here for? Woo! Why does that keep happening? I'm just going to the edge. Um, I actually we were haven't. Here for... I haven't died any times in Elden Ring, but I don't think that counts because I've been following a guide. So. A lake sturgeon kind of cheese a cheesy way to do it but <laughs> we're turning that into a catfish <laughs> nice. nice that was good <laughs> captain dingus is good on the one-liners fishing in the dark oh my fucking god Arthur. stop fucking... don't go on the dock go on the freaking ground hey 305 how's it going Jay McGee is talking about sports. I don't sports. What do you ask? I think the Warriors finna win against the Magics, but I think the Magics about to catch up and come back with an epic lead. Is that like right now? I mean, I don't have the scores right now, Keegan. What yeah, sport is he talking about? Basketball. Oh, hell yeah. How'd you know that, bro? Well, he put a basketball in there, but I didn't oh. know that the... the <laughs> okay. I didn't know that the mag Magic for basketball. I interviewed with the Magic. Didn't get the job. <laughs> Tom Foolery is going on. I did work for the Buffalo Bills. You did indeed. And you interviewed with the Miami Dolphins. But the Dolphins didn't get that either. Well, no, no, no. You did. Yeah, but the pay for, for fifteen dollars. The, the pay an they hour. were going to give you. How the fuck am I going to live Miami for fifteen dollars an hour? Have covered cost of living for us. Golden State Warriors are OP next to the Spurs. Bobby Boucher, win the Bourbon Bowl. Hey, three oh fives in the chat. What's up, guy? Has he been here? I haven't noticed him. He just got here. Yeah. All right, all right. He said, hey, Dan. Hey, Tegan. What's up? You should go back and watch the VOD. I opened the video. I was electric. That's what everybody said. They said I was electric and that light shouldn't have they a They said, light, anymore. we don't want to see you. We want we want the mister. The mister. Listen, you can't start streaming be bigger than me when your freaking name is Mr. Light on everything. That would just be fucking rude. <laughs> yeah. But that's what happened. Isn't that how Strange Rebel started? Didn't she start with, like, her brother? And then, like... Yeah. And then she just... Yeah, like, but the difference was they started together. Mm. I'm not going to be bigger than you. What uh, is going on? This is happening last time, too. Oh, I got you. Dan I does play sports. You. He played basketball. Oh, yeah. Grip that rod. Here Mostly. We Here we go. But he... Um, somebody asked how far I was in Elden Ring. I'm three walkthrough videos in <laughs> that are each 35 minutes. So about an hour and a half. He worked in sports. He worked for the Bills, and then he worked for a local, what are they called, semi-professional? Well, I, you got to tee it up better. Can, be stoned like Mike. Be, like, more hypey. The problem that. is I want to, but I don't know the terms. Okay. And I don't want to say the team because. So, yeah. No. So I worked for two, actually three semi-pro teams before I got started with the Bills, and then I worked for the Bills for um, not two full seasons, but two separate seasons. And it was a lot of fun. The second season, I was in the equipment staff, so I knew the players at the time. This is way back when they weren't very good. So, I mean, it's not as fun to reference because now they're usually good all the time. Where back then, they were winning three, four, five, six games a year. Um, played, you know, Xbox with some of those guys back in the day. It's a lot of fun. But you had to work 80, 90, 100 hours, and you're making minimum wage. So, better lives. We had than that. Curry just hit a three. That's you could say that anytime, anywhere. You might not be wrong. <laughs> Josh Allen was not there yet. 
Josh Allen, I think, was probably in eighth grade back then. <laughs> Josh Allen was in middle school. <laughs> no, this was the 20, thir- 2012 and 2013 season. So EJ Manuel was a rookie that year, if anybody remembers him. He was, I was so sad when he was the nicest guy. He was nice to everybody. And I was cheering for him so, so hard. Um, Hip Hop, right now I am playing on PS5. Good to meet you. Or are you talking about Elden Ring? In which case, he's playing on console. On PS5. Catfish or some kind. Also Maybe on PS5. a channel catfish? Huh? <laughs> Why did you say that? I didn't know if you were on PS5 or Xbox. Okay. Just the way you said con- I'm playing on a PS5, and it's usually it's like, oh, I'm playing on PC, and he's playing on console. But you were like, PS5. Because I knew you were okay. console, but I didn't know which console. All right. I don't well, know what we owned it for. I'm going to throw this big guy back, this channel catfish. <laughs> Joe, are we in the right area? Yeah, 305 remembers DJ. Yeah. <sighs> okay. Count on you, Joe. I'm going to cast, though, while we're waiting. Those channel muskies are a doozy, man. I don't want to try to catch another one of those. What are we here? Bet it smells great. Look. Um... A Claude CS, yes, I did that in my first playthrough. If you're interested, check it out. I appreciate the watch through. Try the big open lake. What are we trying to get again? <laughs> lake sturgeon. So I played this game, as everybody knows, Interstellar is one of my favorite movies. Actually, it is. Just my favorite movie. Um, There's this game called Deliver Us to the Moon, which is on the PlayStation Plus program, whatever that shit is called now. Um, And it has such Interstellar vibes. Except the fact you're not traveling different, like, um, dimensions or anything like that. You're just going up to the moon. But essentially, the world is out of resources, and they had to farm a specific resource from the moon but then the moon program shut down and you're going up to see why but wait you get blown out of airlocks and shit the music's super good and it's super lonely just like interstellar i imagine would be if you were in that world it's highly recommend i'm about seven out of eight chapters in i think and it's an easy platinum for anybody who wants the platinum so and i told tegan she needs a platinum on the platinum blonde channel loner watch it asap yeah loner actually hey, Jeff. Boner, I give you, I'm telling you to leave right now and go watch it right now. Jeff, we, um, in the grand scheme of things, haven't accomplished a ton, but we're, doing we're fishing. Challenge. We're working on a challenge. We have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12 out of 15 fishies that we need for the fishing challenge. The survivalist challenge? Whatever the fuck that one is. And then we also caught um, a legendary. God damn it. God damn it. Where we at? You're yes, I have watched the boys. Love it. A Claude Diaz, uh, we are technically in chapter three right now. And Skynet, we have been appreciating your tips as well. Thank you. All right, where do we to go? Uh, the bigger lake. Which makes sense since we're looking for a lake sturgeon. Probably that one. We're in a ri- These are all rivers. How about this? This was all alligators, though. Yeah, but we need the lake sturgeon from LeGrand. Let's go, girl. Yeah. Hey, FAJ. Is that FAJ or is it Fodge? <laughs> it's all caps, like Peter. The termite scene? Was that the scene? With the. You know what I'm talking about? Whoa. What's that? <laughs> yeah, if you're afraid to say it, probably best not. Or, yeah. if you want to start a riot, go ahead and say it. Or, like my mama used to say, if you don't have anything nice to say, don't say anything. Else. Did 
you get the monster sand yet? Um, I'm gonna eat one of these. Nine, I'm gonna give our horse one of these 99 oat cakes we have. I don't remember if we got the same thing. Hello, Zane. How's bowling? Well, Cobo, it's kind of like one of those things where, like, when you say that, you have to take it from our perspective. Like, we we're not in your brain. So when you say, I have something to say, but I'm afraid to say it, like that just breathes as like, then don't say it. You know what I mean? So like only you can decide if it's appropriate or not. Easy. And when you just put it like that, like of course all of us in chat are gonna be like, eh, probably don't say it. <laughs> like, I don't know. Kind of just how it works. We're gonna get eaten by an alligator. An alligator. Every single time. Hold to grip the rod. <laughs> I got 99 cakes and I know it is one. <laughs> you, you. Mm, Skynet, since I haven't worked with Javik yet, that's hard. But yeah. I guess from just like the looking at them. Fucking Evie, man. <laughs> I can't believe I fucking called her Evie. She's Evie from now on. <laughs> you just can't get anybody's name I right. can't. Hello, Jonathan! We're playing with Ansel. Not How is you? <laughs> the world according to Steve, you know what? As long as you know it. As long as you know it. And you're not afraid for people to, like, say it to you. Like, <laughs> I feel like that's really the biggest problem I have is when people say something, but then they don't like how you respond. And then they get offended when you respond the way they don't like to respond. And it's like, like, that's not how it works. That's not how it works. I have not, Kobo. Point and click. Undertale stories on part 30 or what two are story. What are I've heard good things about Undertale. Mm, point and click games are what? Those are like, um, I just... did you play like, oh, fuck, what were they called? Not Treasure Island, but you probably, Monkey Island? Escape from Monkey Island? Did you play those ones? They're like basically it will be like a scene and then you literally you literally click on what you want to interact with and then your character just oh. goes there and then you can do certain things. Like a lot of times they're like mysteries. Un like no, but you have a character that actually moves around. Oh, like pentiment. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah. But you don't like a lot of times well, yeah. Pentiment. yeah. <laughs> Come on. Cannonball, you're good. Wow. Missing Friday Night Board Stream. If there is one, I have friends coming over this weekend. Nice, Zane. Um, this weekend is going to be Freaky Friday stream. We are working on getting... Bro, bro. Hold on. You're not going to sell it. My job is to sell things. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. Okay, let me see how you'd sell it because... I, wa I just want you to be amped. Bring it up. To here. Freaky Friday or the new... No, the new thing, bro. Because it's going to be sick. Okay. Be sick. We are in the process of kickstarting tabletop board game night again. And we just did some shopping. Y'all are not ready. I'm busting out the cricket. We got some freaking actual boards, like wood. We are going to make ourselves a Gwent play deck, no, if you will. We have the deck. We're making no, 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 like the board, like the... Oh, yeah, the play mat. Thank you. The play mat. Yeah. Uh, we're using the cricket. We're using wood. We're using all sorts of artsy craftsy, which we are not, but we're going to figure it out. And we are going to have a chill Gwent stream or multiple, depending on how You're many people like it. We're going to have tavern music playing in the background. We have already, we already have it figured what out how exactly we're going to set it up so the board you? can be big Mr. on the screen. Yeah, I think so. And have us in it. So. But we need to buy two more cameras. <laughs> so. So it's going to be, Teague and I are going to be facing each other and well, whoever is playing is going to be facing each other. There's green screen behind, green screen behind both of them. And it's going to be tavern pictures behind but we have twinkle lights going on top of the green screen, so it's going to have a twinkle effect just like a candle would look in a tavern. So it's going to be, what's the trigger word now? Or not the, the big buzzword? Cozy, which is like everybody's favorite word for stream now. Um, so that's going to be in there. So we're going to have big on us so you can see all of our cards 
and we're gonna have the board big. But the thing is, we need two more super great cameras because we're not gonna stream with anything that's subpar because that really pissed us both off. So we're gonna get two more 4K cameras and we're not gonna do it until we're gonna put out the quality because it's it gets to a point, well, it's, I, it's not me, but it's you, but like you get to a point where you have this quality so you don't wanna ever go down in quality. You know what I mean? It's like, it's tough to like, when you see something that looks that crispy. But the other problem is I was trying to use the technology I use for these streams and recordings for also my tabletop streams and recordings. And that just does not work. It does not work. I need to use my old PC with different sets of equipment. So the problem there is that means I need to save up for the other sets of equipment. So I need at least two more cameras, which is at least $1,400. <laughs> so we're working on it. We're messing with the setup so that when we do it, the board for the actual gameplay can be large between us. And since we'll only have two people, it will be, it can be a rotating two people, but since we'll only have two people playing, we can have a little picture of me in one corner, a little picture of Mr. Light in the other corner, just for example, and then the Gwent board big so that it's really easy to see. So we don't have the issue of like, what is going on? I can't see that, I can't do that. I think part of the problem right now is we just don't have the space to have game night with lots of people, which is how in my head I pictured it because I wanted it to be like friends hanging out together. But we just don't have the space for that setup. We need a much larger space. And then the technology on top of it, using my current stream setup for tabletop streams also was just not not working. And I can't do that anymore because it was impacting my actual work schedule, which was really fucking pissing me off. So we're messing around with the actual setup. We bought all our stuff to make a really cool Gwent play mat um and then we price out cameras today so we're going to be saving up for those and then as we get more space like eventually we're gonna you know my goal would be to have a dedicated just recording studio um then we can bring back like the more people in the camera at one time i mean how can you just have a baller ass gwent deck like this i'm sorry but you got to use it and that's what we're gonna do and there's other i mean we have a lot of 1v1 tabletop games we just really still love the idea of like the tabletop streams and there's a, from everybody that we talked to at pax like tabletop is like back on the rise as far as like its popularity and if like i said if you walked to any of those vendors that were there it was you were just bumping into people like there was no space to walk everybody was super enthusiastic so um, maybe Exploding Kittens, too, because, like, we've talked to everybody that we talked to was like, Exploding t uh, Kittens is my game. <laughs> Exploding Titans. <laughs> Reese, thank you very, very much. Um, Let's do red. Uh, Kwame, thank you. I really appreciate the fact that you are considering it. Um, Right now, you get early access to videos, and then you get um, access to the member-only emotes. Which I should look at hiring someone to get some more of those. But if too. you stick in the chat long enough, you just might become a member. Yeah. Because y'all are a bunch of hooligans and you keep gifting memberships. <laughs> I say it with love because I appreciate it. Jonathan, so it's funny you say that because her room is actually half the size of the current recording room. <laughs> um, no, but the goal is I want to... Um, we need to finish our basement, so I think I want to finish the basement and have half of it be a playroom for her and half of it be, just be a giant recording space, because right now we're just, like, in a bedroom, so. It's a large bedroom, but it's a bedroom. Is that a pumpkin with a haircut behind me? Oh! <laughs> Okay, that was really fucking funny. <laughs> no. It's Mr. Bubbles with a flower crown. Ghostly Raider, thank you. Lemons, I really do. I'm not a hooligan, you're a hooligan. <laughs> Y'all are a bunch of hooligans and I appreciate the crap out of you. Zane, yes, we did go to PAX East. Um, I went for work, and then I was able to bring him along with me. This trusty old steed. This trusty old steed. <laughs> uh, Wacky Dollar, can you, can you um, repeat your question again? I'm sorry. 
What was called a pumpkin? Mr. Bubbles, a pumpkin with a haircut. He was blurry before, now the camera's okay, focusing on okay, it. Okay, okay, okay. We're still big. Zane, I did not see the Baldur's Gate 3 panel because it was going on while I was in a meeting. A meeting. My streetlight is not floofy. Uh, it's only 9.35. Those are even I think Wacky wanted to see that card again. Do you have that card out, sir? Hooligan shirts for you to buy? On it. This is the special Siri card that you can unlock in the game. Oh, oh Captain Dingus! It's Hooligan Wednesday! Just smacking shit. Alright. So. Ah, mother of fucks. Ugh. Mother of fucks. This is the whole deck. It's pretty big. I'm, so I'm just trying to give you perspective to how many. <laughs> just how many cards are in there. This was the. Siri card I showed you. It's the special edition Siri card that you can get. I think it was like the deluxe whatever, whatever. You know how you can unlock alternate for the hero cards? Yeah. This is one of the alternates from the Northern or not the Northern Realms, the Nilfgaard. I need Loot Slew emotes and Hooligan emotes too. I gotta hire someone for emotes. Do you think it'd be funny if they made like a um, you know how they do that fanfic stuff? Talking to you. Hey, Gavin. We're um, let's keep politics out of the chat for today. Thank you. I was talking to you though. What? You know how they make fanfics? Yeah. Wouldn't it be a funny fanfic instead of the Nilfgaard? It'd be the Milfgaard. Is that just a talk? That's too easy. Is not, it too easy? So fanfic isn't porn. Okay, but I was just saying. A funny, a funny porno okay. could be Milfgaard. The Milfgaardians. Yeah. That'll be funny porn. Um, but okay. fanfic is like just. You know, it so, obviously sometimes. Quave Hip Hop said I looked like Logic, but... so you must be talking about Young Logic, because current Logic is bald and round. Bald, <laughs> and I'm skinny, tall, and I have hair. But I actually I went to see Logic at Darien Lake, um, for three days before we got married. Yes, you did, with you my were... sister. You were lost in space. I was reading chat. Okay. Yeah, I did. I took, and her, because her sister's a really big Logic fan too, so we both went. She was too nervous. She was just like getting stuff ready for the wedding. I was wedding, I was in full blown wedding crazy mode. Mm -hmm. uh, Muhammad, how are you? I'm doing well. Are you feeling better? Kobo, I have the person who made my other emotes, but thank you. Spit something. I could too. the The problem is, you just never know when. Like, it's like you get into a mode and then you just start going. I'm not spitting anything right here. Mm -mm. No. If I was really gonna spit something on stream, it would be the Wu Tang Clan, but you'd have to look for a specific verse that wouldn't get. You know, I mean, they are just my favorite group, though. Got you it. Know, it's just. Mo, how do you hear that? He can rap, yeah. I mean, no, 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 I don't rap. Like, I don't write rhymes. No, you don't, but you can but I, spit But them. I rap with the, the song. Be, yeah. pre, Pre-established already once. Yeah. Triumph, actually, so I have a... You want to have a story time real quick? Sure. We're gonna... already large, okay. large screen, full story screen. Story time. My Catholic school... Next. My Catholic school had maybe 140 people in it, but it had a buddy system. So... Anybody that was older, like, so if you were in kindergarten, you had a buddy that was in the eighth grade that you're matched up with to, like, the, if you want to ask questions or get shown around places. So when I was in kindergarten, 1997, my buddy was Toby Traham. I still remember him. He, at the time, he, he was, like, we seven. Didn't name drop him. Okay. <laughs> Full name drop. Yeah, okay, there's probably a million. Anyway, so he, at the time, he, it felt like he was seven feet tall super cool had this huge blown out afro he was like the epitome of like what i wanted to be in life i went and told my mom i want to have the same hair as toby and my mom was like that's just not gonna work for you i'm sorry but so i still remember he was like hey little danny come over here and i was like that was like the best thing ever that had happened to me i was like oh yeah i'm little danny for the rest of my life i love that name so i ran over to him and he's like hit at the time it was a cassette player which was Wu-Tang Forever 
side two. I put it in and Triumph comes on. And to this day, Triumph is still my favorite rap song because of how, <laughs> and that was the first rap song I because had ever heard. Because an eighth grader made him feel cool. So I was like, this, I was like, I was like, I have no idea what these guys are saying, but like everybody's bopping their head and I'm sitting there and I'm like, this is the best, dude. So Triumph, Wu-Chang Clan, favorite song. Anyway, that's the end of my Little story time. Danny. That's the end. Okay. Thank you, thank you. Good story. <laughs> oh, that was cute. You hadn't heard that one, had no, you? No, I hadn't. I hadn't. I told that at the barbershop the other day, and it was very well received. I couldn't have sounded it any whiter just now. It was very well received. Okay, so now we're going for the Northern Pike in the Sockeye Salmon, and it says Le Gras Bait Shop, the River Lure. <laughs> Freeze, Mr. Light, Paris Social be damned. We could be friends. Yeah. That's honestly, though, like, I get it. I do get it. Okay, I should have done a little bit further than that. Like, I know I, this is seriously the last time I'm going to mention them, but like, when we, when we left the bar, oh, I, was like, okay. I was like, going like, I really do. I was like, I was like, I think, I was like, I think, I think he liked us. And, but then I was like, take a step back, bro. Don't be that <laughs> don't way. Don't be a weirdo. Don't, don't be that way. Just let it be. I was like, we could have just walked out of there. And he was like, oh, God, thank God. Thank leaving. God we don't have to see them again. <laughs> also, we got serenaded by an Ital Italian opera singer straight from Italy. That was, <laughs> that was really fucking funny. He came, <laughs> he came around with his, like, little Venmo thing. And, like, and we all just looked at him like, <laughs> we were like, good job. <laughs> <laughs> Look at this. Look at this guy. Oh, we got his Instagram here. Like, we didn't ask you to sing for us. I'm not tipping you. The fuck? Clive wants to know who your favorite rapper is. My favorite rapper. Uh. In high school, it was Lil Wayne. I was in high school from 2007, 2006, 2010, where, you know, everything that he came out with was gold. So, like... Nostalgia why well This is so tough. It depends on your mood, doesn't it? Like doesn't it? So like Lil Wayne at one point, my favorite like oh, outside of Wu Tang, the album that still has me in a chokehold to this day is Get Rich or Die Trying by fifty cent. Like that was like serious hardcore gangster rap. My mom would not let me listen to that. At all. So I had the edited version. You're I can still rap every line from the edited version. But like, of in the club, like I had never heard the actual in the club until college, and I was like, these aren't the words. I was like, what is this? So like, but get Richard I trying by Fifty Cent. That's a favorite of mine. What'd you get? A lake. Sturgeon. What are you looking for? You're not I'm looking my for a northern pike and a sockeye salmon. But now it's, I really really like Kendrick. Oh, there's a lot going on with him right now. I really like J. Cole. I know these are like kind of like the basic bitch kind of answers because you're just wonder. so lyrically talented. Hey, you're just like, I don't know what you're talking about right now. You just listen and you're like, who is this? I like this. Mm -hmm. Pretty much. Hey, but get me drunk and I can have some mean Cardi B. <laughs> Wait, you're trying to catch a salmon? Is that what you said? You don't catch a salmon in the south. It said, mm. right here, it says northern pike and sockeye salmon in the Le Gras bait shop with a river lure. Really? Doesn't. Sorry. Not quite eh? I don't care. He's passionate about it. Go for it. <laughs> Baby says south of Valentine. Zane, cook it up some. Loner's a Tupac fan. I mean... Certified Hood Classic right there. Anytime he comes on. Let's see. I mean, it's possible God's trash. 
Let me... Let me fact check it here. Okay. Rough Pace says he got both of his in the Kamasa River southwest of Annisburg. Okay. Yeah, that's weird. Like, why does it, maybe they did a typo. Chrome Eagle said the same thing. Salmon, you can get back at the Dakota River. What about the long-nosed gar and the channel catfish? The long-nosed gar is in the south, I well, think. Well, we got the channel catfish. I wonder oh. if because they, like, did it in between, maybe they just did a typo. Like, they copied and pasted yeah. when they weren't supposed to. So we got the channel catfish already, but the long-nosed gar, would that be down here? Okay. Actually, the long nose gar was on that bridge where you caught a fish. Remember the bridge you had to do for the challenge? That's so, well, it's kind of far away, but like if you go down this bridge right here, and actually there's a legendary. You can go get yourself another goddamn legendary. Should I just ride there or should yeah, I? Yeah, you should definitely ride there. Okay, so we'll get the long nose gar and then we will get um, the other ones that I was trying to get before. The salmon and the whatever. Oh! The legendary long nose gar is just where you were in the swamp. What's Perfect! That like? Perfect. This? Oh, yeah, I guess you could fish for that bad boy. Okay. What was this legendary over here? Hey, so, all right, so Como just donated five bucks, which is pretty cool, but he said, here's a trick to get the long nose guard to stand on the train tracks, which is exactly where I said to go. Okay, um, but if we want to get the... But you should just do that legendary. Do we need all the legendary for anything? Yeah, to get 100%, you need the... Okay, so we might as well fish. double dip then. Yeah. What bait should I use for that then? You should double dangle. Nope. Yeah, somebody... The special one. Um, yeah, this would be a lake, wouldn't it? Because it's not a river. Yeah. Oh, wait, no, no. There's a special Whoa, swamp over isn't there? Yeah, get in there. Get up in there and look. Come on, thank you for the donation, too. Appreciate that. Oh, yeah. All right. Every dollar you donate, going to new cameras. <laughs> should we also... Should we put them on throne? Yeah, I mean, might as well. Yeah. And then start, go back. Or... Do you... Yeah, that one. This could work. Honey pork. Wait. Salmon. Like Ireland? Did we know he's from Ireland? I don't know. There's a lot of people to keep track of. You don't want to. You don't want to. Stop it, game. You don't want to be that. Cast that far out because you're gonna then you're gonna have to reel like super far. Where if you well, just... okay, but there's like. Greedy shallows. The problem is, I can either do super short or super long. Yeah, I mean, you cast it at like Thanos. You just kind of have to cast it like Captain America. All right. What motivated me to have a YouTube channel? Um. She wanted to be famous. Yeah. Make no bones. Lifestyle of the rich and the famous. Now she's happy she wasn't a child star though. Yeah, seriously. No, but like obviously. That was not throwing shade at being a child star or making light of the situation at all. It no, just that's a fact. like a fact. Um, I kind of like ever since college, I just wanted to. I did always just want to be famous though, growing up. When people asked me what I wanted to be when I was older, I would say famous. That was my answer. I'm not even kidding. Um, then in college, I was like that was kind of when. YouTube channels started taking off for gaming. And I was like, I really want to do that. But at that time, I didn't think I could because it was like, people that are actually good at the games or were like over the top personality, not in a negative way, but you know, you know, the like the stereotypical like gamer, YouTuber or streamer. I felt like at that point, that's kind of all that really was around. And that wasn't me. And I also just didn't think I was a good enough gamer to do that. So I didn't. And then when I first started teaching, 
in my first teaching job, a bunch of my students would talk to me about different YouTubers that they loved watching for gaming. And I was like, damn it, I really want to do that. Um, yep. And I just didn't. Yep. And Come then on. when Red Dead 2 came out, Mr. Light was watching a lot of different Let's Players. And I didn't even realize that that was kind of a thing. Um, and he was watching Mars specifically. Um, and I really just loved her style and she just felt much more laid back than anybody else that I had seen before that. And I was like, you know what, that, that's kind of what I feel like would be closer to what I would be. So I kind of had it in my craw that I wanted to try, so I started looking into it. But I've always let fear hold me back my entire life. Always. With everything I've done, I've let fear hold me back. Uh, and then we were drunk in Chili's one day, and I say we, and I mean me. I made half of a strawberry margarita. And I was telling my... I was with Mr. Light and my brother, and I was talking about how I wanted to start the channel, and, you know, I had that liquid courage in me. And they were like, well, what would, like, what would you even do? Like, what would be your, your thing? And then, since I was half drunk on a margarita, oh, fully drunk here. on half of a margarita, I was like, well, I'm a lightweight, and I'm a bad gamer, so let's lightweight gaming. And <laughs> my brother was like, wait, shit, that's actually a really good idea. And I was like, I know! And then, that weekend, I literally... Ordered a capture card from Amazon, nice. it came in the next day, and I recorded my first video. Alright! Lingerie Long Nose Gar. Perfect. Charged. Keep that but shit. You're mine. Thank you, Reese. I appreciate that. Listen, sometimes, Captain, you just need a little bit of liquid courage. That's all. That's all. Did you get what you needed? Yeah. Do I feel famous when I stream? No. But I also don't okay, think I need that girl. anymore. Like, that was always what I said, but I don't think I need that anymore. Did you... Somebody asked who your inspirations were. Um, so obviously I said Mars already. Um, Alaska. Alaska. Well, her name's not Alaska on YouTube anymore, but it was Alaska at that point. Um, Strange Rebel. I liked her content a lot. Geb Smolders. Um, shout out Hollow. He's my favorite YouTuber. Well, you didn't get the legendary though. What? I thought I did. What'd I catch? Did it say you caught it? Did it not say I caught the legendary? <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> Just a big boy. God damn it. My brain filled in what I wanted to see. Slow. <laughs> yeah. Hold on. What the um, fuck is that on there? What'd I get? Go up to it. Legendary long nose car. You know what? Now that now that I'm I did get it. Yeah, I'm remembering that this marker is glitched and it doesn't X out. Um, well, that's dumb. Very specific memory. I, I'm, I'll get you to this place now. Actually, we should probably turn this in. Um, yeah, eight bites was another one. A girl in a game was another oh, one. Yeah, duh. Yep. Um, and we still, I still talk with those two like pretty regularly. Yeah, again, it was like super good people. Yeah, they're both. I, I haven't met them, but from what you said, they sound awesome. They're the only two of that whole list that I actually like know personally, and they are both very cool people. No, she's just not. <laughs> oh, your wife should be a <laughs> creature. To be fair, Hollow is really freaking cool, and if I could get to know Hollow personally, that would be another yep. bucket list item checked off. I would love, love, love to do Red Dead Online content with Hollow when I'm trying to get the Platinum. I think that'd be fucking awesome. I didn't... Honestly, I've been watching no, Hollow since nice. before Red Dead 2. He was the only guy I actually... Because I used to think YouTubers were... I was. I just didn't find any enjoyment in watching people play games. And then, I forget even who it was that showed me one of his videos. Mm -hmm. I was like, I, that guy looks cool as hell. I'm gonna watch, like, and then whenever I didn't necessarily feel like playing, but I wanted to consume gaming content, I would watch 
Oh shit. And then it just. Red Dead came out and I was obsessed and I was done with it. But I wanted to watch it right away and that's when I started getting into other people playing. Him and the Red Brad, I haven't talked to either of them personally, but they both seem like really cool people. From like an outsider who doesn't know them perspective. I don't know, I was like, fellow dad, it's like, this is the law. yeah, there's a lot of that in this, and some of Oh, well, I did not know Miranda before you took And I didn't know her until I was established at YouTube, so. Uh, Zane with, with what? Yeah, I didn't know you could make grilled cheese without butter, to be honest. <laughs> Joe, I have not caught that legendary Hello yet. there, pleased to see you. Send mail. Got something to post? All right, we're going to send these two legendaries. Okay. Send them off. I'll be sure it gets to oh, the right oh, folks. Oh, bang. What is going on here? Why can't I send it? This will get where it needs Ooh, to. He hates me. What needs to go where? There we go. All right. Can't do two at the same time. We're going to receive some mail here. We got, oh, thanks for the late one. Gee, you're so <laughs> kind. That's good. Come on. Right. Lemons, we got baby light saying, oh yeah. She's doing it great too, by the way. Oh, lure. I uh, have not heard about Zack Scott games, no. No, it was a strawberry margarita, which is why the channel name is Lightweight Gaming. Because if you, I don't know if you have, you probably don't all have chilies, but they're margaritas. They come in like a, not a margarita glass. They come in like a pint glass. Good evening. And I was halfway through that strawberry margarita and I was feeling it. Like full on giggles. I'm gonna save just in case you get run over by anything here. Fisher. Chili's uh, does exist, but we don't eat there anymore because they don't have any items that I used to like on the menu. <laughs> but their strawberry margaritas are really freaking good. Yeah, they're honestly though the food quality is just at least I can't I'm not gonna speak to at all chilies. Our chilies. But our chilies went down big time with mm -hmm. I don't know if it was just COVID or what. Like, they changed every time I go in there it's like um, it's a different menu, yeah. but also, like, every single item that I liked, no longer there anymore. I'm just on the lookout for things. Also, can you save? Oh. All of our Applebee's over here are gross. And actually, they all closed, so that should show you how gross they are. The one we used to go to. Climb, buddy. Oh, yeah. Cotton candy martini. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, Crimson Cracker, he, Chili's wasn't even bought out. It was just every time you went, literally the actual menu was different. So even if they had the same items, you could go one week to the next and the paper and design would be different. It was the most bizarre thing. I'm like, why waste your money on this? Like, what the fuck is happening right now? My favorite restaurants? Um, I guess I would say Longhorn Steakhouse Come on. would be one of them. Um... We had a mom and pop pizza shop in the town that we live close to. Uh, that was also my favorite, but they're closed. They would make wood-fired pizza that was absolutely divine. I freaking loved it. But they closed during COVID. Um, so they would be an honorary mention. They were kind of mad. I freaking loved them. No, they tried to get a bigger spot in a different town. 
because their spot that they had here was too small. Joe says you need the special lake lure, but um, it said this was a river. We'll see what she fishes up here. There is panda in New York. Oh. You're magnificent. You're, mag you're magnificent. Yeah, <laughs> damn. Oh. I'm just that fucking good. Would you Sorry. look at that? The river lure you're worked. Not. Bingo. Take that thing. Don't get hit. Shh. Why would you speak that into existence? Horse, do not come here. Do not. Nesta, I will smite you. No, I get a boat when you can just run on the train tracks like a badass. That train line's not active. You're good over there. It's just that main line you gotta watch out. Okay, let me check the... What do you mean? Wait, hold on. Lemon said there's not a panda. We have a, literally have a panda in the village. Unless they're talking about a different panda. Yeah. No, I think we're talking about the chain panda. What do we have? The one that we have is a mom and pop restaurant that's just also named Panda. <laughs> well, that's kind of confusing. It is. Oh, he's trying to bite it up. Wait. Help okay, me. there. Go help these guys. Panda Express. Is that not what we have? That's not what we have. We have a mom and pop restaurant that they just happen to be called. Gotta help me. It's like Panda How Cuisine or something. How can they do that though? Like, oh, so we can just start a business and call it Target? They got my wife, Target please. shopping or something. I don't know. Oh probably. Gotta do something. All right. Where is she? It's a sacked out in the swamp by the oh, water. Should go do this. <laughs> Okay. Go, do this. go on. See if you can find the law. I'll do what I can. Uh, okay, I go about finding more help. Uh, Lock in. Ouch. Help! I'll read Somebody out the chat help. here. <clears throat> do I need a gun? Oh wait. Shit. I think I just muted. I just muted. No, it'll be good. Okay. Um, no more. Huh? All right, we have a lot of people saying that they don't use Twitch because they felt unwelcome in those communities. Well, luckily uh, we won't be solely Twitch, so that won't be a problem. We also... Uh, what? Quave? What in the world? I don't think I got this random event in my playthrough. Well, you're in for a goddamn treat. Yeah. Hope that sounded real crispy. Can I just go this way instead of following them? You run the risk of gators. Screw them gators. But that's that's the shack you're going in. I'm gonna I'm gonna shut up for a minute. Cause we got this is real good vibes. This is really cool. I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna do this. I can go fuck shit up. Lancaster. Yeah. I would also. I mean, you're inside. So what is good inside and close quarters? Shotgun maybe. Double barrel shotgun. That'll do. Oh, you gonna hurt my feelings. Yeah, but I don't want to hurt her. You know, you may, you do bring up a good point. Yeah, go with the pistol. You'll be fine. Yahtzee. Fuck you. Sorry I weren't here sooner. Oh, 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 thank the Lord you showed up when you did. All right, so, um, hey, look it, you're in the positive honor. Yes. All right, so Zane says, Lemons, you have you ever been to honor. Roses? She Christ. said, I don't think so. What I pretty much stayed in Ann Arbor. Would you um, please get them out of here? No, Skynet, we got Dave and Buster's here. We actually used to go every Wednesday because it was half price games, and we went there so often. <laughs> that we couldn't go on any other night because it felt like a waste of money when it wasn't half price. Oh, I'm sorry, spin. Wacky says repeater, you went pistol, that's fine. 
Um, Kobo says, thanks so much for showing the Garrus conversation before talking to Edie. Is that how you say it? Or is she EDI? Or as I was calling her Edie. Is she the one with like the big fat ass? She's the robot. Oh, so no? She has a big fat ass, but she's oh. a robot. They all have big fat asses. Okay. When she got her body, I didn't talk to him, so I didn't get to see what I missed. So he saw something new. So that's cool. Um, Loner asks, has anyone eaten at Hot and Juicy Crawfish? No, but it doesn't sound like a can, so... Oh, yeah. She's allergic to all seafood, so that doesn't work so great for her. We were actually on a cruise to Alaska. S sorry. Sorry if you've heard this already. We do have to take her somewhere, I believe. I get eaten by gators. Um, or talk to her or cut her free. Um, or maybe not. There's some money I put away There's in the sack there. Away in the sack it ain't there. Don't take it. Well, please, Don't take, take it. it. You're all right now, ma'am. It's over. Let's hope my Horus found another guardian angel like you. Unless it wants you to take it. I was just hoping to get a little extra honor there. Does it make it? Yeah, I, th I don't. I think you should take it. <laughs> Gotta inspect the sack. That's where it is. Again, you my garden angel. Appreciate it. Good luck to you. Um, basically what happened on the cruise was Okay. I've never girl. so I always knew that I was allergic to shellfish. Oh yeah, my bad. I stopped mid-story. I always knew I was allergic to shellfish. Um, but I never had like fish fish. It just always seemed really gross to me and I didn't want to try it. Um, but I was on a freaking Alaskan cruise. And my dad ordered a fish fry, and I was like, I'm in fucking Alaska, I need to try a fish fry. So I tried some fish fry, and that was a mistake. I <laughs> uh, couldn't even make it back to the boat before I, I'm not going to call it anaphylaxis, because that's not what it was, but my throat was closing up, and I had a horrible rash a on minute. my neck and going up my cheeks. This one didn't X out either. Um, and I was having difficulty breathing, so I had to buy Benadryl in the ship shop. I probably should have just gone to the freaking medical the ship person. Shop. The shippy to the shippy to the ship but shop shop. I have a thing with not liking to go to doctors unless I'm literally dying. Um, so I just bought some Benadryl off out of the ship store and took Benadryl and I literally slept like 24 hours and missed the entire stop of the ship. Yes. So. And slept through an earthquake. <laughs> well, you can't feel an earthquake on the water. Yeah, but we were docked, but still. Everyone was like, that earthquake yesterday was so crazy. And I was like, there was an earthquake? We need to buckle up here because we can't stop the stream until we have 15 out of 15. I know. I said that. We only need two more. Breaking news. What's the breaking news? <laughs> Press secretary abruptly hangs. No. Hangs up. What did it say? I couldn't read it. Hangs up on radio host. Oh, that was like so clickbaity. Didn't like it. Okay. okay. Anyways, um, we need to get the northern pike and the sockeye salmon. All right, look up the locales. They told us already. Those are the ones up north. Wait, so you're telling me the northern pike is north? Yeah, isn't that crazy? Ah, damn. So, Joe. Or Skynet. Year 305. Um, Van Horny? Did you say about Van Horny location? And I'm pretty sure I should probably have an EpiPen because also recently we get this snack box in the mail that has like snacks from different countries in it and we get it once a month. And there was these seaweed potato chips, seaweed lace chips. We should and be I due for one of those soon. So excited because I freaking love seaweed. I'll just eat seaweed packs. They're so good. Um, and I ate one of the chips, and then I was in the middle of editing. So I stopped, and I started editing, and all of a sudden, my, <laughs> I felt my throat closing up, and I was like, <clears throat> like, I could still breathe, but, like, I was, like, clearing my throat and coughing a lot. Northern Pike. And. Some salmon. The Zakai salmon. salmon. So he said Okraze. Somebody said Okraze Run, which, yeah, that would be north. That makes sense. Near Okraze Run. All right. Um, so, okay. God. Oh, wow. Okay. 
I broke it, we caught lots of fish, and then we saved the lady from getting essayed. Yep. But anyways, I was eating that- I ate one of those chips, I'm editing, all of a sudden I feel my throat closing up. I'm like, what the fuck, this is seaweed. And my mouth is burning and tingling, and I look at the bag, and I look at the frickin' ingredients, fish. We don't need to be bashing other creators here. Like, that is not what this is for whatsoever. And this isn't even my channel, and I think that should just go without saying. So let's just cut that oh, shit yeah, out. Oh, yeah, I did not. Nope. Let's not, just cut that shit out. Not Because okay. that's not cool. Not cool at all. I didn't even see that. Thank you. So we're going to go over the little craze around here. Seaweed is great for you. I love seaweed, and it's kind of funny that I can eat it. You have it's the only thing from the water I can eat. You get that on I didn't even think about it. I was like, oh, it's just gonna be like seaweed and a potato chip, and nope. I'm, I really wanna go to Japan, and I'm, I'm honestly kind of worried about it though, because I feel like I'm gonna run into that everywhere. Like, there's gonna be seaweed, or there's gonna be. <laughs> there's gonna be seaweed. There's going to be fish and things in lots of things that I'm not even gonna anticipate it being in. Yeah, I get these little, they're like snack packs of seaweed, so all the rest of these tiny little seaweeds. So I think somebody can fill in the paraphrasing gaps that I'm about to lay out. But, um, if my memory serves me right, O'Cray, the name O'Cray, was the last name of the guy who played Uncle from the original Red Dead 1, who had recorded the singing lines in Red Dead 2, but then died during the filming. So they named it after him. I might be remembering that one. Who it is exactly, but I know there is some significance to the name. Um, the said use the lake floor for the northern pipe. Cobo, I technically already record everything in 4K. Um, yeah. So. Yeah, know. this current camera is a 4K camera. I think so. my, my, even my capture card is 4K. And everything is exported in 4K as well. So I feel like you should have the option to watch it in 4K. I can watch on it on YouTube. 4K. I have no problem with that. Okay. Stay there. I can't hear anything. This is cool. Yeah, that's why I'm kind of worried. So, the first time I go to Japan, I'm just going to be going to Disney, so I feel like that'll be easier. Um, Get out. I kind of already pseudo have a trip on the books for that. Um, but I want to go to Japan to actually like explore the country, but I'm genuinely worried about having food that I can eat that's not going to kill me. I'll just have to eat rice. I'll just live on rice. Yep. And I know all their other food is delicious, but I don't think I can risk it. Or I need someone to like make a business card that says, I'm allergic to fish. Is there fish in this? So I can just hand it to everybody because I obviously can't speak Japanese. Then it says, you can find the legendary standing on the rock next to the lighthouse. We're going to a craze right now. I think we're almost there, but thank you. You're the man of mystery. Yeah, Reese, we're gonna need a rundown of all your all your various jobs because you have had some like wide wide ranging in careers. <laughs> Shit balls. 
Yeah, Loner, I would love to eat all of their food. I freaking... What? We didn't turn this fish in. Oh, that doesn't matter, right? You're supposed to turn them in by mail. Okay, but I thought you said if you lose them, it doesn't matter. All right, just go do it right now. I'll just keep going. You just lead me to my pap, and I'll leave you to Whoa. yours. I'm broken. Shh, don't speak them into existence. <laughs> Night, Jay, thank you so much for joining while you could. Yeah. The beer baron. Yeah. No, I haven't had sushi. Um, I do like, I always, I butcher it because I'm from freaking New York and I don't speak Japanese. I know this is not how you say it, but I cannot actually, I don't know how to actually say it, but I always say tamago, which just is just the egg and the rice wrapped in the seaweed. And I love that. Um, but I can't have sushi. Oh, wait a minute. Sushi. I'm such a dumbass. I'm so stupid. Nobody called me out for it though. We're not here to catch a legendary. All no, oh, right, no, right, right. Said it. Yeah. It's too much, too much going on. Are you? Oh no, you. Um, and I can have like vegetable sushi. Well, I know that's not sushi, but vegetable wraps, whatever. But yeah, I would love to experience the culture of Japan, but unfortunately, you know, I don't want to die either. Can I just punch this and take it off? Lake Lure. And I had to, I have had some people be like, well, maybe you're just allergic to sea fish, sea fish, shellfish. Oh my god, can't talk. To shellfish, and they fry it in the same batter, so that's why you had the allergic reaction. But like, I'm not fucking risking that. <laughs> why would I? Why would I chance that again? I just, it's just, no, I'm just, I had the fish, I had the allergic reaction, I'm just counting that is what it is. Yes, Unbroken, um, I have another Mass Effect video recorded for tomorrow, and then I'll be recording Bloodborne for Sunday, but it will be a very, friend. very long one. Hey, yo. Hey, Especially if I can't freaking beat that boss. Yeah, I really, I really want to see everywhere. To be honest. Zane, look at you. Zane, I can do that. Zane, just where are you? Oh, suck well, it doesn't really matter great. because now we only have one more. I guess we should break down for posterity. Still the lake lure, eh? If I see anything pink, I'm letting it go. Um, Jeremy, this is the final for the survivalist cha challenge. Well, I grew up watching Lonely Planet. It's real old. Real old. Um... But my dad and I would watch Lonely Planet together, so I think that kind of instilled a travel bug in me. Uh, and I just, I really, and also the historian in me, I just want to, I want to experience all the cultures and see all the cool history. That's pink, right? Yeah. Cut that shit. Cut that shit out. Zane, we're only at nine trophies, but almost bad. all of the challenges are done. Um... Take it. Take it. We only have three um, challenges left. And after this, it would be two. Okay. Or we have four, and after this, it would be three. I don't know. We're really close, though. Okay. How many do I need to platinum? I think there's like 40. 52. Hold on. You doubt. You 52. doubt me. <laughs> yeah, I'm too poor for that, Kobo. Would you fish take the bait? God damn it. Oh, I got you. I got you. Ooh, that thing's spicy. 
You hear Sounds that? it. You hear that? I do. Sounds a little suspicious down there. Skynet says legendary. Uh, yeah, we're not getting legendary right now. Skynet, we're just trying to finish up this challenge. Thank Survivalist you. 10, baby. Borderlands. 65 trophies to platinum. But, like I said, my first trip to Japan is solely going to be a Disney trip. Because I don't want to do both. Because I want to have a solid two weeks for Japan. And I don't want to have to waste time in Disney. But also, I really want to go to Disney. Um, and my dad basically lived in Japan for like two months. So he doesn't need to do a whole big Japan trip again. And he does want to see the Japan in Disney. The Disney in Japan. So, he said he would take me. Come on, you fish. Stream restarted. Stop being stuck in a rock. Pick that shit up. Whoa, okay. Loner, I freaking loved Ireland. Can't sing his praises enough. Wacky Dollar can tell you more, though. <laughs> it's a musky. Is that what we needed? No, it's not what we fucking needed. <sighs> Off you go. Off you man. go, then. A northern pike. Mother fucking fuck. Um, London was fun. We literally did 24 hours and didn't need more than that. We saw everything we wanted to see. <laughs> Ireland is great. I want to go back. I want to see Baby Light. Um, and Scotland is really, really high up on my list. Okay. Hold level 2 and hit square. Where do I find the energy to power through all these games? Find myself wanting to sleep after an hour or two usually. Determination. <laughs> Reese works in engineering database management for a manufacturing company. Hell yeah. That sounds like smart people jobs. That sounds like a job that would have a lot of acronyms. Well, it kind of sounded like it was like a family trip, so. <laughs> I'm gonna start my ads and crafts over here now. What? Are, what? Collar, if you hear me. What are you doing? Starting my ads and crafts. What? How? You gonna bust out the cricket? Well, I have to wrap it in vinyl first. Oh, 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 oops, didn't shit. get the hooks I yet. <laughs> I can't talk while doing this. I thought we were gonna keep the board, the wood board, and we were using the vinyl to cut out the shapes for the different things. Nah, dog, it's gonna be black. Oh. Well then, I don't have vinyl to cut out for shapes then, because if we do black vinyl for the shapes, you won't see it. All right, I guess we'll talk about it then. Your face is stuck in Excel all day. I've had a couple days like that myself. What is that line from Obi-Wan? Or is that not Obi-Wan? I'm an adventurer myself. Or, no? Okay. I'm something of a something myself. It could be, but is I don't know where you're Obi getting at. Is that not Obi-Wan? It could be, okay. but I don't know where you're getting at. I'm not picking up what you're putting down. Yeah, well, that's... Your reference game sucks. It do. It do, though. Um, somebody in chat finish it. I'm something of a blank I myself. I got some hook. That's oh, a I salmon. Know. Let it go. Do I want that big boy right there? I'm something of a scientist myself. I think you do. I think that you does. Well, hold on. Let me look up the RDR2. I put it right on him. Come hither. Come get this. No, oh, now I'm fishing. Got some. Is what it like. 
That's not I think you got a musket. I think you got a. I think you got a. The coloring's not wrong. The coloring's well, not right. Well, you know, give, well, it could be. Give it a it's shot. Not orange. It looks probably like a little musky here, but. Yeah, this is not what we needed. So you just throw it back. Good to in. meet you. Good to meet you. Trying to south side of the lake. Oh, rip. <laughs> yeah, we did not update the trophy count, unfortunately. I kind of forgot we got a trophy last time. Take your horse to get there quicker. You might want to look which direction is south, too. I did. Oh, okay. You're just a badass. Como donates another five dollars and says, "Yeah." I also remember there's a lot of northern pikes in Van Horn area by the lighthouse. The legendary northern pike is in no craze. Sorry about that. Oh, uh, okay, nice. Well, thank you. Buddy. Sweet. Oh, uh, is that bald eagle? Yeah. Let's see it's kind of a small circle, but it looks like bald eagle. Yes. Easy. Whoa. That looks like a great little spot to fish. Should lay down a camp and then just cook some shit. Those are muskies. Those are muskies. However, there may also be another part. Don't you love the font for Oak Ray's run? Oh. White noise music from movies specifically. White noise. See, my white noise is more like bits and hits. Um, oh, look, Sam. They're my actually, honestly, they're like my new favorite ambient people to have on. Their shit is just slaps so hard. You, sir? You, sir. Our fish. There it is. <clears throat> We're gonna have max. Should I not get the fish right now? Should I just have like the regular lake lure? Um, yo, definitely. Just the lake lure. Wait, so is there a legendary here? How's about this bait, I wonder? Bits and hits. Hits. H I T S. Bits and hits. Their Skyrim shit, especially. These are all muskies. What bait should we be using for the northern pike? And I thought I should be on the northern side of the lake for the northern pike. Oh yeah, you can't catch their legendary until chapter six, but you can catch a, reg a, leg a regular northern pike here, correct? Oh, that muskie just flopped. A regular one is a Van Horn. Yeah, I guess you can. I would try one with the, the regular lure. Well, I did, and I got a musky. Okay, all right. Go to, land. Go to Van Horn. Rappé got one in the... So the Kamasa River and the Van Horn area oh, are nice. parallel to each other, so you can kind of just go back and forth. You guys want to hear some really crazy story time? It's like super unfortunate. If, if that's not the vibe, I'll hold back. No, you should tell. Do you know what I'm going to say? Yeah. 
With your sister ship. Oh my god. I know you. Wow. Yeah. So for those who don't know, my sister works on a very, very well-known cruise ship. Um, she's got a sweet gig. She doesn't do anything but dance. Um, doesn't do anything but she... No. She's a professional dancer and no, she dances no, no, on no. the ship. No, no, no. Okay, so... Maybe I should explain that better. So, most of the time, if you're working on a cruise ship as an entertainer, you're also doing other shit. Doing dishes. Like, yeah. like cleaning up after people. She is just a performer. She just dances and goes about and goes about her day. So, she loves it. She's seen all the Caribbean. She's seen all of, like, both, all around the United States, all around the coast, every coast. And she texted me the other day, and she goes... I think the cruise that mom and dad are going to be on is going to be potentially canceled. And I was like, and this is big because my mom hates traveling, like major travel anxiety, won't get on a plane. We, th we flew like two weeks before 9-11. So she was like, I'm just never going to fly again. So she goes, or my sister says, we had two staff die today in an accident and I was like excuse me she was like there was a hot steam leak it exploded and killed two people and I said what how does that happen on a, on a well known cruise line I guess she said that the um, the special doors that they have so that if there's a leak on the ship it doesn't have a Titanic situation um, they couldn't get those doors open, so the steam killed them because they couldn't get out. Yeah, and my sister was like, the scariest thing is they're just telling us to go about our day and not telling us anything else. And I was like, okay, well, that's unsettling. I agree, that's unsettling. But... Uh, she's not Minnie Mouse, no, she's a... She's a dancer. It's not a Disney cruise, although Tegan would really love that. I would love that. <laughs> if it was. So, yeah, that was disappointing. Hope I wasn't... Where should I go here? Hope I wasn't bound to secrecy with that. I think it was in the news, wasn't it? I mean, you didn't sign the NDA. No, I did not. So. The lighthouse? Okay. That's this, right? Oh, let's see what this says here. Oh, no, it's right online. Two crew members die aboard Holland America cruise ship. They were in the Bahamas that day. It's fucking terrible. Damn, dude. It's the first time I've actually, like said it out loud too like mm. and can't believe spring break is almost over yeah same alright so I need a river lure yeah Kobo's dad is officially in a Maybe. Hollywood production first step getting his own movie series going, movie series going, so more more than one, but it's going to take a while, so I'm sure you can't tell us anything about Here it. Here we go. That would be breaking rules, right? I'd love to hear more about it, but I have a sinking suspicion that you have to keep it quiet for now. But congratulations. That is super duper cool. I would love to be in Hollywood. No, I wouldn't. I'd love to be friends with Timothy Chalamet, though. Shout out to him. I I'm sure. Be friends with Margot Robbie. I'm sure. I'm sure that you're watching this stream, Timothy Chalamet. You have. You have nothing better to do. Hey, he's a gamer. He might. You never know. <clears throat> Modded controller 360. He would like the controller that was painted that he I bought because he used to paint them. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we'd be bros. I know we'd. We'd be cool. I like Wonka for what it's worth. I like it. He's making skinny guys cool. Gumby, back in style. Let's 
Crimson Crackers has been getting into RDR too. Crimson Crackers, that's the name of all names, bro. I love that. Uh, Timothy Chalamet is from... Yeah, so actually my sister knows like all of his teachers because I don't know how. So that's the end of that story. But she said she knows all of them, School, and maybe? and they all said that he was like like one of like uh, he was always like the teacher's favorite. So anyway, yeah, Kobo says you are correct. Diana can't say anything. Gosh, dang it! Skynet says skinny guys were always cool. They were not. They were not. We went through a bad phase there for a long time. Marvel did us dirty, because Marvel made the female gaze. Um, about wide, thick chinned, thick, thick boys, all muscle, no fat, Thors, all those dudes. That's what they made the female gaze. Funny story. Can I go on a tangent about the female gaze real quick? Sure, but then I'm going to correct you after, but go ahead. Okay. Hold on. I'll let this fish go. I'm not catching anything anyways. Nothing's biting. So, my buddy looks over to me one day. I was talking about my little chin because I don't like my little chin. And I was like, I want to grow a beard so I can cover the little chin. And he's like, yeah, that's just, that's just not the female gaze nowadays. And I look over at him and I said, you mean lesbians? And he goes, no, no, it's just not the female gaze. And I said, lesbians, like, what are, what are we talking about here? Like, why are you saying that? And he had the bright idea to say, okay, let me try to use this in a sentence like the spelling bee. And he goes, no, like to gaze upon something. And I said, why are lesbians up on something now? I don't get it. What is, what are we talking about? And then he wrote it down and I, and I figured it out. So here we are. And that's that. Can you get this fucking fish? So I think English is hard. Yeah. People are loving that story. That story is amazing. And I told you it would be. I know. Anyway, here we go. Anyway. Here we go. Okay, I'm going to type it in the chat. <laughs> I think Ken would have appreciated that one. I don't even know if that's actually how I spell gaze. Why are two lesbians up on something? <laughs> we gotta clip that. What time is it? It's 10.38. Dude, my skinny chin, when I was younger, old women would just go, I love your little chin all day long. And it was like, at that time I loved it because I thought it was like this great thing. <laughs> Dominic, but first time to join ever. Why is nothing biting? What are you using here? The river lure. A river lure. We are. It's a river. This is a river, huh? If that ain't a river, I don't know what the fuck is. <laughs> It's a goddamn Lanahassee River, goddammit. <laughs> this is this. So this is a legendary here. Yeah, but we don't need the legendary. We just need a fucking regular one. What is that legendary thing, though? What is the legendary that's here? I don't know. Because, like... All right. Apparently, I'm too... Chipmunk cheeks! Apparently, I'm too self-conscious. I just got in the right to Oh, those could be what we need. Or are those muskies? Those are muskies. They got red tails. God damn it, muskies! That is the legendary muskie. Oh, fuck that. No, hold on. Let me take it off. We've caught too many of those assholes. Fuck you, muskies! Uh, let's try something new. Damn, that is scary. Wait, Lemons, you were at a zoo when a lion got out? Jesus. 
I won a coloring contest and I got to go into the elephant enclosure and then they took the elephants on a walk at the zoo every morning. They walked them around the zoo for exercise, but that's intentional. Didn't our lion get out? Wait, you were at the zoo- you were at our zoo when our lion got out? How did I not know this? What the fuck? How did that story not get to my ear holes? <laughs> Please do not pet the lion. Damn, what'd they have you guys do? <laughs> You're in! <laughs> hey, our, uh, speaking of urine, are we, uh... It wasn't that big of a deal when we were there. A lion just roaming around the zoo. No big deal. <laughs> Do we have a date tomorrow? Suicide Squad? With the new update? Apparently, we can't just use the Joker. We have to, like, beat Brainiac again. Crumb says... A little further northeast of the horse stable, if you have no luck here. Are you lying? Here we go, here we go, here we go. Northeast of the horse stable. So that would be like this titty. Nipple, sorry. Don't look at me like that. Don't it's do it. Titty. I won't catch this fish for you. Thank you so much for joining us. You and you're always good for the chat vibes. We appreciate you. Sleep well. Yeah. You want to chat? Excuse me. Can you? Yeah, I'm. I just. I don't know. Wait, are you me? Is it about me? No. Oh. Okay. I just don't know if it's for serious or if it's a troll. Right. Lord, I want a taco. It could be either. <laughs> you know, you were supposed to make tacos twice and we went out to dinner two nights in a row. And Fuck. whose fault is that? I'm not blaming you. I'm just saying I can look forward to tacos hey, tomorrow hey. because we still haven't eaten. That's all I'm saying. I'm not throwing I was ready to cook both nights and you were like, no, fuck it. Well, I had stuff to get tonight and last night I wanted some steak sub. Bro. Cannon boy, I did. People are crazy. No, thank you. No, thank you. They're like, oh, we've known them since they were kittens. But no. River lure? We want the river lure. Okay, Dominic. <laughs> to be fair, it's Wacky Wednesday, and sometimes you never know, because, you know, euphemisms. Kobo says, I'd like to invite Tegan and Dan to the premiere, if I'm allowed to do that. That is years and years out, is it? Is it? I Did, would assume would it... so. Oh. I, don't, I don't know shit. So this is like a book, well, say what you can say, obviously. Don't this say anything. You don't want to get in trouble. Okay. I was just going to ask if it was a book being turned into a movie. Well, we can... we Don't say anything. Don't confirm nor deny, but we can make that assumption because I think he said his dad's an author. So. Oh, so we can use brain cells is what you're saying. We can infer. I can... All right. All right. Interesting. Interesting. Jaron, I didn't skip your comment, but you retracted it, so I didn't know what you said. <laughs> yeah. For... I, can't, I can't skip a comment if it's not there, bud. Oh, no, but uh, right above it, it says, Tegan, what's up? Red Dead, how are you? Your spool is out of line. I need to quickly reel. You're not quick. Arthur, you're weak. Night, come on. up already. You're mine. See you later. Apparently, you can retract your own comment. Oh, yeah, this is it. This is the one. The moonlight hitting off the water is amazing. Yeah. Agreed. Jeremy. Yeah, this is cinematic on purpose. We're doing it for you guys here. Late. Late on the East Coast. Not that late. It's 1044. We're just old as fuck. Jaron, we were traveling for work. We're back now. We're streaming. We're at PAX How's East 2024. Had a great time. Spent a lot of money. Met a lot of cool people. And drank a lot of alcohol. He did. I did not. I had a lot of Pepsi. This is a goddamn. Someone keyed your truck today, Dominic. I'm sorry. That's the worst. No? Mm? You, <laughs> sir, wow. are a douche. 
I have a feeling if I named my stream Taco Cooking Stream, Hell we yeah. would get clientele we did not want. Hell yeah, bro. It's a goddamn Fucking musky. Maybe next time. Yeah, no one had Dr. Pepper, and Boston is not a Coke town. It is a Pepsi town. I had, um... Actually, so the first night, I don't think I... All when right. the moon hits your line with a big fishing guy, that's a musky. Wonderful. Who is that? Captain Dingus, but he said a northern, but we thought a musky, so I changed Absolutely. it. Absolutely. Well, all right, Captain Dingus. The wine, the cab that I had the first night at whatever restaurant, I don't even know the name of that place we went. Do you? Because they nope. had it they had it in their Uber, and we just like, show, like we're, okay, we're going to this place. So my mic was just like, Oh, I got recommendations. So we just hopped in the Uber and we got there and he's like, it's that door right there. And I'm like, okay. And it was tiny and it's music bumping. We're like, you can tell that, okay. that guy's just got a pension for getting shit done. And so it was just like, yeah, that sounds good. Let's go. We walk in, there's like a total of 10 tables tops. Like it's small. And the hostess was like, do you guys have a reservation? I was like, no. And she goes, ooh. I'm like, and she's like, how many do you have? And I was like, we have four. And she goes, actually, I can get you in right now. And we're like, fuck yeah. Yeah, let's do it. Sat down immediately. But that's what that cab that I had was like otherworldly oh, delicious. Like it was so good. Corey, nothing is wrong with Pepsi. I'm just a Dr. Pepper gal. The thing, like, you have to give them the full gamut though, because like you were a Coke through and through. I was a Coke girl through. Just and like lines and just lines worth. And that. Don't get me canceled. <laughs> You think that I just... Naming a stream anything taco will bring Weirdo Wednesday to new levels. Free Shavakadu. <laughs> My liver won't be able to... Are you making a drinking game? Wait a minute. Uh, urine wants to go to PAX? I don't think you understand. Listen, hold on. You're Stop your clapping. Because I, I need to set the precedent for... There is so many people there, bro. I think you're going to hate it. But I would love to have you. But also, we have I just a hotel. Want, I just want you to have the right... We have hotels, so you don't have to stay all day. You go back to the hotel. Because by the end of it, even I was like, damn, bro, I could use some space right now. Also, this year, this year, and this is not, this is not negative. This was just me. I was surprised by it and scratching my head a bit. There were a lot of furries. Like, a lot of furries. What do you mean? Like, like you mean dressed up like animals? Like, yes. Oh, well, that's yeah, a gaming but, convention. But it wasn't, like, it wasn't, like, characters. Like, furries. Hmm. I was surprised by that. And that's not, like, if that's your lifestyle, go for it. Like, I am not judging. This is no judgment zone. But I was surprised by the amount of people. Is Dan a secret furry? I was surprised by the no, amount of people. I'm the only Italian in the world that can't grow hair anywhere but my head. Because you're half Irish. God but damn. also, there were a lot of hairy Irish people. Oh, the only thing I I took from the Italians was being oily. That, that was it. It was... It, I mean, there weren't a lot, but there were way more than I was in. Like, last year, I don't remember seeing a single one, and this year, I at least saw six. Can we have a little bit of a conversation about Quidia? Oh, yeah. Okay, so there's this booth. I'm gonna, we gotta go full screen for this. We gotta set the stage. There's this booth, right? It looks fucking cool. There are these like circles, giant circles that look portals. like portals or mm -hmm. stargates. Like imagine like a stargate, but inside is a, a screen that has a different cool thing. So one looks like you're walking to a portal of hell. One looks like you're walking into a portal to the underwater. One looks like a portal to space, like really cool. There's like three of them in a circle. And then the booth has like little archways all around making a circle. So it's kind of like its own little enclosed space. We're like, what the fuck is that? Doesn't say anything about a game, but then they have huge LCD screens in the back saying like, hey, come talk to us and we'll register you to win like monitors, gaming PCs, like peripherals, like a bunch of cool stuff. So the line was crazy. So we never went in because we we're like, A, I don't know what the fuck that is. And B, I don't need to win any of that stuff. Like someone else can win it. So I don't go. We met some people. I I was going to say we met some friends, but we, we've talked to them like four times. Yeah, so I guess I probably that... shouldn't call them friends, but they were really freaking cool. Give them a little plug though. Zach, ZVCH um, on Twitch. He was actually really, really cool. So ZVCH on Twitch, watch him. He was awesome. And then Wolves at my door on Twitch, yeah. also watch him. He's also awesome. Yep. And his girlfriend, who no longer streams, Kate, she was freaking cool. Um, anyways. And then, and then Bert, right? And then Bert, yeah. but he Bert. doesn't stream either. 
Um, they were all freaking awesome. So yeah. shout out to you guys. Thank you for making our trip really cool. Anyways. Zach comes they, up to us. And Zach like, comes up to us like, quit ya. Yeah. <laughs> and he explained the rundown. Apparently, it's a, they're trying to make a, an esports city in Saudi Arabia. So basically, it's a Saudi Arabian company. I think we got it. That are trying it. to get esports players to move there. And they'll like sponsor their visas. And they'll Guys, make, I, like, I just had stage fright. I couldn't catch it while you were watching. They like were making it this whole huge thing. So they were using the giveaways to get people to come in so that they could try to get you to move to their city. But if you ask them any questions, they wouldn't answer it. And also none of the people working were actually part of that company. They were all like um, from Estonia. 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 They were all from Estonia. Yeah, because we met them up at the bar afterwards and I was like, bro, we got to get out of here. So all the people working there, like the actual people were from Estonia. And then the people that they had like trying to reel you in were just like contractors that they just like hired to like work the event. So it's a Saudi Arabian company backed by Saudi money where you would have to live in Saudi Arabia, but it's run by Estonians and then contractors were the ones trying to get you in. But, but if you ask them any questions, they would not answer. You were not allowed to take videos. You were not allowed to take pictures. Yeah. If you ask questions, they were like, this isn't a game. This is the future. And we're like, what the fuck? He said, this isn't a game you play on a console. This is a game you play in real life or something. That yeah, was something the, like he, very... Anything about video games. If you talked anything about video games or like, oh, I'm going to go do that. He was like, oh, you don't... You don't play this on a console. This is real life. This is and, real life. You and that, that was like, the, it was like the only line of dialogue they were given. So they, it was like an NPC just spamming it and <laughs> over they would, and over again. They would just keep turning on that, but you weren't allowed to take pictures with every other booth. You're allowed to videotape, take pictures like that. That's allowed everywhere. Not here. Um, and they wouldn't answer any of your questions. It felt so culty. It was so culty. And everything was about just like winning prizes to get you in. Yeah. 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 yeah, yeah. So it was, it was real, it was real, real sus. The definition of sus factory. Yeah. Definitely seemed like if you went there and gave them your contact info, you would be disappearing a little while later. So I was real glad we didn't go there. Real life Kiflam. You're right, Dominic. <laughs> Shell of safety. Shell of safety. Shell of safety. <laughs> I'm like, I've watched too many cult documentaries. No, thank you. Yeah, we're big into the cult stuff. We are. Yeah, <laughs> you're right, Lemons. You want to see if there's a pretty horse to buy here? We can't get rid of Nesta. We can stable Nesta. And we can make a new horse. Like, um, another... Oh, my God. Sorry, horse. You guys missed that. He just jumped over a fence and landed on a horse. Into the horse. With his horse. Whoa! You know... Yeah, but it, it was fun learning about them for a minute there. And, uh... Definitely not recommend it. Somebody shooting at me? It's hard to go in the back door. Spoiler alert, not everybody appreciates you doing that. So I'm gonna go in the front door. What the fuck are you looking at me like that Boo. for? Boo! This horse got worms or something. Damn it. Managed on the horse. Of course, body safe. It's, it's super boy. effective. Whoa, that's shiny. That's our horse. We own these two. Oh. Why are they so shiny? Do you want to sell them? No. Well, because they're clean. We just haven't had a clean one in a long time. <laughs> I think we should get rid of this shire. All right. And Wait, the, where's well, Floofy? Floofy is gallivanting. Floofy's on her own. <laughs> She's Dude. living her life. So let's man. just get rid of the. T so this was Sadie's horse, okay? Oh, okay. So we're gonna get rid of her. All right. All right. Goodbye, Tennessee Walker, Texas Ranger. With so for six people. whole dollars, and this Shire, That's all she was worth. this Shire is the one that Hosea gives you. It's worth two dollars and forty. No, don't sell it. Oh my God. But why? It's only worth two dollars. What's the freaking point? They don't have any horses to buy here. All right, so see, we don't need a seller. I just like keeping a... Uh... Skynet, I didn't buy... I don't think I bought the Ultimate Edition for PlayStation because we already own, like, five copies of this game. Yeah. Elsewhere. Yeah, I made sure... Wait, can we get a little... Pro <laughs> were, you, were 
screen skills. I love that this dream has had several full screen PSA so far. <laughs> yeah, and you know what? I feel like I feel like I have to deliver on that Witcher stream now. Listen, if you want to stream, you can start streaming, but you just got to make sure I'm not recording. That's all. Yeah. You got to work around my schedule. If if we can, if you could guarantee. Not to be that bitch, but you got to work around me. If you could guarantee that you would, you have nothing to do on Sunday from like noon to two. I can't stream to nobody. I don't have that type of self confidence. But I'll stream. Oh, come on. I'll, I'll stream to two. I posted my first two videos with the only three viewers were. You know it's two different. family members and one student. You do know it's different, streaming live in front of no one and just posting a video that nobody watches. How though? Because I'm when I'm recording, you're still talking to nobody. I knew when I was going to post it, nobody was going to see it. It's no different. Yeah, well, I just you know you know I'll do whatever works for you. Okay, look at this. Hold on, wait. This is going to make you real satisfied. <laughs> Aaron says the key to a good. The key to marriage is good compromising. Dan, you can do whatever you want as long as it works for her. <laughs> That's right. Okay. So here we go. Look at this. Can I show you this real quick? Yep. Done. 10 out of 10. Weapons expert. Boink. Survivalist. Boink. Sharpshooter. Boink. Master hunter. Boink. Horseman. <laughs> Herbalist. Herbalist. <laughs> You could, I could go around picking herbs if you want for the next three minutes. Gambler, wait, go back. Oh, my bad. Gambler. My bad, no. my bad Dude. Dog. I'm getting to it. Gambler. Boink. Explore. Boink. Bandit. Right. <laughs> so, I mean, that's really the only one that makes it look not complete. To be fair, that's intentional. You could do that in half a stream. All of those. Yeah, but I need my own a good. I know, and we just got it. We just got it good. If mama ain't happy, ain't nobody happy. It's the truth. Hell yeah. Look at it. We're 40% total completion. We haven't even. <laughs> Boink. <laughs> Are you doing Bandit after the campaign is done? I'm saying yes. I'm going to wait until we're John. So not like. The campaign done done, but and like get money. the money Arthur no. campaign. Well, yeah, you can't really even do any of that stuff. You don't have to walk if you can. But it's just really the story. Alright. Take a shot, Bree. <laughs> don't do that. Don't do that. Yeah, Dominic, what the hell? Why is she here, truck? Thank you, but we are unfortunately playing on PlayStation. Slow it up. Yes, I will. Apparently, you work too much. <laughs> oh, don't kill the dog. <laughs> what the fuck? Where is this guy going? Yeah, Rafe, it definitely makes it look like you haven't made much progress until you really get into the meat and potatoes of it. But we really have. We've made a lot of progress. Are well, there certain challenges that come up with later chapters? Um, not necessarily. Like, there is a fish that we can't catch yet, but that's not for a challenge. It's just for 100%. And then the bandit challenge, we could technically do all of it right now, but it hurts his honor, and I don't want to do that. There are some optional missions that you can miss in Chapter 3 that we don't want to miss. Night, Zane. See you next week. Have a great weekend. All right, so let me, let me let me get a fresh save, and then you can talk about Friday. Oh, yeah. Like, what's Friday? Dude, I'm so fucking tired. I need to go to bed. But I can't, because I'm bad at it. Damn, dog. Damn, dog. Thank you, Unbroken. Would it be better for me to do a stream on Saturday or Sunday for you? Because I need to tell these people. Uh, so I can get somebody. Reese, if, it's, if you're going to be there, I'll do The Witcher. If you're not going to be there, I'm going to do Skyrim. You can't stream Skyrim when I have never made Skyrim content. That's bullshit. You can, and I can, and I will. Do with, The Witcher. The Witcher's your favorite, one of your favorite games. And so is Skyrim not? You're right. It's not in my top it's five. It's not. But it's in the top ten. Okay, but it's not in your top five. You should stream in top five. Boy. Don't do that. I'm Don't do that. Being Arthur talking to a horse. Why can't I do that? Yeah, but I've played the top five at nauseum. Like, at nauseum. Okay.
we bring the tacos? I can also tell my uh, female gay story again. Again. Do you think if that would be clipped, we would get canceled? Did I was that a bad story to tell? Or? No, that okay. was just English being okay, English. Okay, okay, okay. Can I stream 3 a.m. to 5? You know that would be best for everybody's schedule. Reese will be there no matter what. Okay. Well, yeah. Wait, um, but you need to make a Twitch. Hold on, I have a Twitch. It's not your name, is it? No, it's... I. What branding do you think I went with? Oh, I yeah, need, we can see that. I need a profile picture first. <laughs> Mr. Lightweight. I just wanted to be Mr. Lightweight. Dude, you're going to have a bigger following than me on Shut Twitch, and people are going to be like, you, what the fuck? You always say that, but, like, no, I won't. I literally haven't streamed on Twitch, so how are you not? Yep. Do the Witcher. Okay. No, no, no. I'll do it. All right. I have a Twitch in my eye. I expect all... Of, I expect tons of followers now from this. <laughs> Mr. Underscore okay. Lightweight So should we do Twitch. Saturday what time? Or Sunday what time? I just need a full day to freaking record Bloodborne. What would you so rather do? I guess that oh, well, means Saturday. Need... I guess that means Saturday. But yeah. fuck it. Um. Thanks, Lemons. I appreciate that. You can just make a Gumby-looking motherfucker if you want. Can I? Let's see. What's today? Wednesday. We don't stream tomorrow. Can I record tomorrow evening? Thursday. I have to get a movie reaction done too. Mm -hmm. Fuck. Man, time goes quick. Oh my god. Or I can stream on YouTube. I don't know. What, should I? What should I? Should no, I you stream? You gotta do Twitch because if you're gonna do this, it has to be helpful to me. Wow, that's rude. No, it's not. This is my name. If you have problems finding me, is there a link I can put in the chat? Mm -hmm. Twitch.tv slash Mr. Underscore Lightweight. And you got to plug the friends here. My only subscription that I have, go sub to them too if you have the funds. Kind of funny. They're the coolest peeps. Go sub to them. I don't work. Who's that? I don't work for them, but. Um. I, fuck. I guess stream Sunday because I'll have to record Saturday. Because even it, well, I guess if I can record Bloodborne tomorrow, it won't be a long video because I won't have that much time. I just want to let you know when I play The Witcher, I get into that lore. I listen to them talk like I'm in there playing that fucking game. And we're probably going to Gwent our ass off too, just so you know. Little Gwent. Um,. I'm going to be swinging my swords. Why do you look stressed? Because I fucking need child care. <laughs> that is fucking ridiculous. We'll do a two-hour one to get it started. That'll it. That's it. You can use the rest of the day. You like, do... the fact that I literally don't ever have a break. I literally don't ever have a break. I don't ever have a break. Mm -mm. And I work until, like, one in the morning every single fucking night. And then I go to bed, and I wake up, and I do it all again. Yep. I need child care. Well, next, this is. I don't have the, enough time. This I is, literally don't have enough time to do everything I need to do. Yeah, but this is the last bad week, though. Until it's, there's another bad week, because, until someone else gets sick again. Because we got two grandmas kicking in now. We got her Dude, grandma. Did your and grandma we got say my, she could? Yep. Tuesdays and Wednesdays. She called me today. She didn't mention that. Why did she call you? She, why did she call you? Because I'm cool. She wanted, she wanted to shoot shit. No, she was asking for um, glasses for the eclipse. Oh, hell yeah. Um. Fuck, I don't care. Pick a day. Skynet, follow me. It. I have a follower. I'll work around it. Pick Hold a day. on. Where do I see that? My inbox? Hmm. Hmm. I guess I should follow you. I didn't know you actually had a Twitch. Dude, I'm so fucking tired. I'm crashing I big had... time. Memento next week, Unbroken says? Uh, I thought we were going to do Oppenheimer. Sloppenheimer? Dude, I don't even know where to see that shit up <laughs> <laughs> I'm so lost. I'm just so used to YouTube. You would think you would just go to your page and, like, that would be that. My channel. It says I have zero followers. You might have followed the wrong guy. Yeah, you're not showing up with Mr. Underscore Lightweight. Oh, that's not good. What does it say, though? Did I spell it wrong? Is there a space? There's Is there a space between Mr doesn't appear so but like how would why would you find a channel that has zero people that's there's zero followers that's never streamed 
Oh, do I have to switch to this? No. Yeah, I can't find you. I don't, thank you. I don't need an apology. So, I just need to fucking fuck up and figure it this out. This is why I'm doing this first. So I can troubleshoot and she just bangs on the channel and she's like, oh, it works. No, I have nothing. I literally just made this like days ago. Yeah, there's no Mr. Lightweight here. Am I on here? Can you guys find me? <laughs> Thank you, Jeremy. It won't Hold show on. your channel if you don't have anything on it. Yeah, I'm going to text you this link. Can you email it to me and then I can copy and paste it? Can I email it? Fuck yeah, I can, bro. They said, you got to go live first, dumbass. Um, which one do you want me to? Uh... The 19? The one that's on the... No, do the other one. This one? Mm-mm. Yeah. This one? Yeah. All right. <laughs> this message has no subject. Do you <laughs> want to send it? Of course I do. Of course I do. I want a new tab. Hold on, peeps. I'm going to copy and paste the link in there for yeah. you. For anybody that's actually going to show up, dude, that's cool as hell. You don't. You definitely don't have to do that, but I appreciate you. Maybe you should just go live right can you, now. Can you just so can, can you click on you. that? Can you click on that? Like the link and just see where it brings you. Okay, yeah. So that's me. I need a profile picture. What should I use? Should I use the the one I use on YouTube? The Ooh. Dominic says he'll watch. Oh yeah, you gotta cut that. <laughs> we out. don't you want gotta, that. You gotta cut that out, bro. You trying to out me? Apparently. You trying to out me, dog. Night, Cannon Boy. Cannon Boy. I'll talk wrestling if you show up. <laughs> Look at now I'm bartering with people. <laughs> this guy that says he'll Photoshop you with a beard. Fuck yeah. <laughs> Let's see it, dog. Hold on. Let me get a straight angle for you. Here. It's good. I'll put the picture of, uh, of us together so people know what's good. And, uh. Captain Dingus followed me. You, you Woo! Look at that feed. Appreciate all you. Appreciate all you. Hold on. Let me see. Where's my account? I got to uh, see. I like this because now it's now I got to do it. I can't not do it. I have 45 followers. You have 45 followers? You never posted a damn thing. Nope. Kristen says I should do cosplay streams. All right. You want to see... Everybody stream. You want to see Gumby? Where did you... Where did you, um... Skynet, thank you. Appreciate you. Semper Fi, appreciate you. Mike says, sorry I missed live. Late night at work. Oh, sorry about that. Mike, we're happy you're here. We're ending. We're just talking Twitch right now. Where did you find your link? So I went into creator mode. I don't know fucking shit. And then at the bottom. Channel. I This page. You need this page. Stream manager. Yeah. And then share stream. I think people found you pretty easy, though. See you, Joe. When's our next Red Dead? Monday? Yeah. I All cannot right. type with my nails. I promise I type faster than this, but my nails makes it tricky. All right, I'm going to add a profile picture to this so you know who you're following. I don't know if this actually works. If hey, any, there she is. If anybody's a super talented artist and wants to do some art for my stupid small chin, hook me up. Should I do this pro <laughs> my professional photo? <laughs> People would be like, who the fuck is this nerd? 
What a nerd! I'll post it right now so you guys can see me in business attire. He's handsome. No, I do. I slay the day away on this. Night, Rafe. I mean, morning. Mike Patterson, it has been a stream, let me for, tell you. For anybody that's not on my Twitch right now, check out that professional portrait. <laughs> oh my God, bro. <laughs> that guy can invest some money, let me tell you. Okay. Actually, let's go back to something fun again. Watch, it's going to be like, you can't change your profile picture for three months. <laughs> you could do investment streams. Mm, you You can't do I, investment streams. That's illegal. Like, so illegal. Well, it just has to but be, like, oh, should I no, do this but one? like education. Oh, yeah, that's cute. All right. That's cute. We took this at the photo booth at the after party of PAX. That way you know, okay, that's light. Oh, that's that's Mr. Light. Here we go. Okay, so schedule for this week. Tomorrow's Mass Effect 3. Thursday is tomorrow. Fr <laughs> Friday is Freaky Friday stream. We're going to be playing Poppy's Play Room? Playtime? Yep. What the fuck is that? Poppy Playtime. Poppy Playtime. And Ken will be here. So he'll be in the stream because since we're not doing board games, I was like, listen, or tabletop games, I was like, listen, you can still come hang out. So Ken will be here and maybe Kevin will be here. I don't know. Mm -hmm. um, and then Sunday will be Bloodborne. And that's that. Yeah, but you know where you want to be Sunday. That's twitch.tv, Mr. Under Light, Mr. Underscore Lightway Gaming. No. Nope. Not at 2.30. You can't be stealing no. my viewers at 2.30. Oh, so I would do, I'll do noon to 2. All right. That works for me. But seriously, if you don't show up, it's not gonna it's not gonna fluster me. I'm gonna fucking go. I'm gonna get after it. And we're gonna cut some we're get gonna cut some people. Or get going. Night cannon boy, thank you for joining. We're gonna get after it. Get that boat. We're gonna get active. We're gonna do it. And maybe I'll make it so big that you don't have to work another day in your life. And I can take you anywhere. But I like doing this. Yeah, but but like, I want to do. But this. there's no stress because like you can do it. You can go on all the vacations you ever wanted to go on. All right. But then. But then. We would just go to Disney anyway. All right. Yeah. <laughs> Night lights. Boo. All Wait, right. no, Rap, hey, see, my stream time on Sunday is, like, perfect time for you because that's, like, <laughs> that's, like, actually daylight for you at noon here, right? Or early evening. That's true. Best time to watch. Dinner and a movie. All right, you all. All right, you all. <laughs> all right, y'all. All right, you all. Appreciate that. God, you thank you for the chaos. We are done fishing until we need to go after the legendaries, but that will be on pause for now because we can't even get them all anyways. Um. Thanks for shooting the shit and having a good team wacky wednesday going on vacations teaching people how to play video games heck yeah um so yeah i'll be back with uh pre-recorded mass effect tomorrow and dominic i'm so sorry about your truck go give it a pat for me sincerely lightweight gaming cheers everybody slancha to my Irish friend. And we will see you again on Friday for Freaky Friday.